Hey, what's going on everyone? It's Dan here. Guys, I want to welcome you guys to a brand new series for the channel. This is Martha is Dead. Now, I know it sounds like a very kind of a dark title, you know, just blunt. It's not very happy, naturally. Um, but it is a brand new psychological horror game that actually takes place in 1944, Italy. Now, one thing about this is it's it's apparently a very, very, um, there's some messed up scenes. You know, there's a, the whole idea behind the game is there's a lot of disturbing imagery. Um, and in, in fact, recently we discovered that if you're playing this game on PlayStation, like PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, you're actually not getting the full experience, believe it or not, because actually... Sony has made them uh, cut certain scenes from the game. So basically, if you're playing all this on PlayStation, you guys aren't getting the same experience as those playing on PC and uh, uh, Xbox. So I think that's really interesting that uh, you know there's a bit of censorship in that. So I don't know what was censored. But regardless, we're going to get the full experience because we are playing on PC. Um, now, one thing as well I want to mention is um, this game is is very true to form. And the default setting, you can change it if you want. I'm leaving it. Because the default setting is the main, if, if you don't change any settings whatsoever, the game is, is played uh, where, where the audio, the speech is in Italian. Makes sense. You're in Italy. Um, and the subtitles are in English. You can change it so you get that the, uh, the speech is in English as well. But I've always had a, a bit of a gripe. I've always had a gripe with games where, I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't ruin it, but I think it just kind of changes the immersion of the game when people are speaking English in a place they shouldn't be. You know, especially in Italy in 19... Why would anybody be speaking English? You know, it doesn't make sense. You know what I mean? Like, the select few people would, sure. But the average person is not going to be speaking English. So I'm going to have this in... Um, I'm going to be playing this. It's going to be in Italian, and there's going to be subtitles, okay? So I... If, if it ends up not working out, I'll switch back. But honestly, I'm, I'm not going to yap at all during any speech because I need to be able to read it. You guys need to be able to read it uh, so we actually know what's being said. But I think it's for the best that we keep it in the Italian language just because it's more true to immers immersive. And that's the way they intended it. That's, that's the language they intended it to be displayed in. So we're going to go with that. And I'm really excited. This is going to be a full series long play of the game. Apparently, the average length for this puppy... Comes in at anywhere from six to seven hours, depending what you're doing. We've done that in our sleep. So <laughs> I'm not too worried about completing it in that time frame. But we're going to be sitting through this all day, completing Martha is Dead. It's been a minute since we've had a psychological horror game. And like I said, this is one of those games that depicts death, murder, uh, but also throwing in war-torn elements. 1944 Italy, you know what I mean? It's all during World War II. A lot of grisly scenes, grisly moments, but I think that's what's going to make it really shocking and quite the experience for us. So, ladies and gentlemen, hope you're ready to rock and roll with this. Martha is dead. Obviously, don't forget to leave a like on the stream. Say what's up in chat so that I know you're here, and we will get into this puppy and hopefully have a good experience. Let's go through the chat really fast, and we will get started in just a moment. All right, here we go. What's up, Boost? Hey, Marth. Uh, what up, Sean? Hey, Matt. What's up, Disney? Hey, Tyler. Hey, Teresa. 
Oh, of course, it's being one of those. Hey, Annie. Hey, Eileen. The game is like slowing down my la my. Uh, sometimes that happens, where I don't know where the game hogs all the. It run stream runs fine, but you know. Anyway, uh, what's up, Patriot? Hey, Staley. Hey, Judd. Uh, what up, Blair? Hey, Tommy. Uh, what's up, Annie? I don't know if I got you yet. What up, Judd? Hey, Sean. A random. Uh, what's up, AJ? Uh, what's up, Gareth? Hey, Yao. Welcome. Uh, what's up, Fox? Good to see you guys. Uh, I'm sorry. It's a very slow scroll right now. Very slow scroll. Um, what's up, Classic? Hey, Eric. Oh, what's up, Vicky? No, I'm not going to play Elden Ring. It's not my style. Not my jam. I know everyone's freaking out about Elden Ring, but I just, my interest isn't really there for it. So it is what it is. All right. Okay. Let's go ahead and get this thing started. What's up, Blair? Oh, did I get you twice, Annie? Look at me go. <laughs> I forget who I talk about, who I say. So just to show you, this is literally the default. Italian, you can change, like I said, you can change it to English, but it's set to default. Subtitle font size, I'm actually gonna go small. I think that looks weird. I think the smaller the better for that. Wait, head bob amount? That's interesting. <laughs> uh, but yeah, everything is good. There's a streamer mode, so any music you hear is not copyrighted. Uh, we're running on ray tracing with performance DLSS. So we should be good Gucci. Ladies and gentlemen, without any further ado, let's jump in. Martha is dead. Let's go. Spoiler alert, she's dead. You know she did. You know Martha did. <laughs> I, I don't really want... I mean, I, I feel like we need to have our comedic elements, but... You know, left is barely visible. Well, that looks super bright. I don't want it to be too low. Let's go 0.40. Because I know people will be like, I can't see shit! Just because their brightness is turned all the way down. All right, the story of Martha's Dead is, is, is it, and its featured characters are work of fiction. The game contains potentially uncomfortable scenes and covers topics that may distress some players. The game is recommended for an adult audience and carries the appropriate age rating. As an adult narrative drama, the game uses artistic interpretations that can be visually unsettling and may cause discomfort. It explores the complexities of the human mind, psychological trauma, and self-harm. The game is not recommended for players who might find depictions of mature scenes containing blood, dismemberment, disfigurement of human bodies, and self-harm disturbing. Here's the thing. This isn't the first game where that that's been in there, you know what I mean? Like I, I this they even disclaimed this, and Sony still was like, eh, I don't know. Let's take those scenes. So they actually had to edit out those scenes. So and what's funny is because is what's funny about that is all the digital copies are done and ready to rock and roll. But if you ordered a physical copy on PlayStation, actually delayed it because they have to reprint it onto new discs. It's kind of fucked. Anyway, if you are somebody you know is struggling information crisis resources see they actually have that too every time like there's a game that's the thing i feel like games like this really do like anything involving self-harm depression suicide whatever they always tend to like make you really feel for it more and you do like it shows the realisticness like we're all safe in our little bubbles and people who aren't dealing with it you know so games like this so like oh censor that well, to a degree we shouldn't be censoring this kind of stuff you know just so we can understand the impact of it people who don't understand can understand you know It's, this is not censored. This is not censored. I have the uncensored version. The censored version is only on PlayStation. I'm on PC right now. Ciao. Sono Giulia. Giulia K. Sono contenta che tu sia qui. Nessuno veniva più a trovarmi. Da anni ormai. Devo raccontarti la mia storia, lo so, ma non so da dove cominciare. Ci sono così tante cose. It's quiet. It's really quiet. Dovrei iniziare dalla mia infanzia, ma di quel periodo ricordo così poco. Solo quell'estate era il 29, mi sembra, quando fui mandata a stare dalla tata. So her her volume is mad quiet for some reason. Everything is maxed out. New chapter of the legend, summer of 1929. Tata, mi racconti la storia della dama bianca? No, passerotto, non questa sera. Sta salendo la nebbia, vedi? Sì, lo so che la dama uccide le giovani donne quando c'è la nebbia, ma perché è così cattiva? Vedi, Giulia, la sofferenza e la paura ci spingono a fare cose cattive, anche se non siamo veramente cattivi. Come i soldati che uccidono gli altri soldati. Mi piace la dama, ho deciso, tata. 
Poverina, soffre così tanto, però continua a fargli un po' paura, sai? Io sarò presto una giovane donna e lei potrebbe uccidermi. Uccide anche chi le vuole bene? Certo che no! Allora io mi sento più tranquilla, io le voglio bene. E mia sorella Marta è in pericolo. Marta è con la mamma, puoi stare tranquilla, ti mancano. No, cioè, sì... Mi manca un pochino Marta, ma con te sto così bene. Ora dormi, passerotto. Si è fatto tardi. Sì, tata, dormo. Sognerò la dama. Era molto bella? Era molto bella, sì. Molto bella. Allora io la sognerò bellissima. Io sarò bella. Bella come lei. Tu sarei ancora più bella di lei. Senti, tata, visto che la dama non mi farà del male perché le voglio bene... E visto che tu non sei una giovane donna, mi potresti raccontare la sua storia anche se c'è la nebbia? Ti prego, dai, lo dormo, promesso. E va bene, l'hai sempre vinta tu, piccola peste. Amavo la tata e amavo quella storia. Ogni volta che la sentivo era come nuova e mi stregava sempre di più. Tutte le sere le chiedevo di raccontarmela. Anche se mi faceva paura. Ancora oggi mi sembra di ricordare ogni singolo giorno di quel periodo. Com'ero felice. Un'antica leggenda racconta che i laghi della zona sono abitati dallo spirito di una giovane donna, morta per mano dell'uomo che amava. Aspettava l'incontro galante fissando il vecchio albero sulla piccola isola del lago. Ok, I'm gonna pause it. Do you guys... I can't really get a consensus. People seem, I don't know, kind of mixed bag here. Do you want me to put it in English or do you, should I leave it? Because if I put the subtitles any larger, they're gonna get hidden behind me and you're not gonna actually be able to see, like, part of the subtitles. And the audio is maxed out, so I don't really know. I guess I could crank this a little bit. Let's just put this up to that. Maybe that'll help you guys. Because, um, I mean, the whole thing, the game is meant to be played in Italian, but I guess for streaming, if people are having a hard time keeping up and reading with it, maybe it's going to deter the stream more than help it, so. Okay, well. I can see that. Most people are having trouble reading it. That, that I can understand. I can understand that. Okay, well, we'll do English. I think that makes... We'll see how it is in English. If it sounds weird, I might switch it back. But if it's fine, whatever. Il desiderio, le speranze. Ma ad aspettarla c'era la morte, non l'amore. The poor dear. That's not fair. Life isn't fair, Poppet. But that's the way it is. And we must learn to deal with it. Okay, I'll try. But it makes me so mad. Keep on reading, Nanny. In despair, the man confessed he had killed her out of jealousy. So, he was hanged on the small island, in the middle of the very same lake where he had killed the girl. They searched everywhere, but the girl's body was never found. Since then, her spirit, known as the White Lady, has been imprisoned in the depths of the lake. She grieves eternally for the loss of the man she loved. When fog arises, the White Lady is known to leave the waters of the lake and roam the woods, looking for her long-lost love in vain. Within the fog of dawn, hunters have claimed to hear the wailing of a woman in the distance. 
You're a child, you never stop yapping. I'm a little scared of this story, even though I like the lady. Should I stop reading, my little sparrow? No, Nanny. Daddy always tells me that fear must be faced. Go ahead. Okay, honey. Every time the sad memory of the night she perished stirs in her soul. She takes the life of a young woman by slaying such a life in its youth. Even just for an instant, the lady feels free from the burden of her pain. That's not fair. <laughs> Good night, Nanny. Good night, my love. I spent almost three years with the nanny, but when I came home, I quickly forgot how to be happy. My memories did not return until 15 years later, in 1944, when I stayed in that house. I enjoyed setting up cameras in the woods by the lake. My father created a device that attached to the cameras. It would make them take pictures at set intervals. I was trying to photograph animals or whatever else was in that damned place. Okay. The lake. So I noticed this game is framed. Like it's like it's like a picture camera. Like it's like a picture camera. It's like a, well, it's a camera. What's up, Unicorn? Hey, Canex. What's up, Leo? Reel off the film. Open the camera. Remove the old roll of film. Film in. Close the camera. Load the film. Activate the timer. Almost ready. Now to bring the image into focus. There's something floating on the surface of the water. If I frame it better, I might be able to see what it is. As a thanks for the super chat. Well, I've never had that happen. Somebody promoted their own channel through a super chat. <laughs> Okay. Oh my. What? Is that a person? I must help them. Well, naturally not. I mean, it's not like... someone might have drowned in my lake. The lake was my world, where I would spend entire days daydreaming. I would lose myself in my thoughts, but that was a rude awakening. So terrible. Wait, what is she doing? Is she going for a swim? Dude, this person ain't real. I extremely doubt this person real. <gasps> I 
I instantly noticed that the person was wearing one of my dresses. I was scared. I dragged that lifeless body as best as I could to the shore, trying not to drown myself. Only when I lifted her in my arms did I realize who she was. It was my sister. My twin, a part of me. Dead. Impossible to comprehend. I was desperate. I didn't know what to do or to think. I have to stay calm. Damn. That is, uh... Martha is not dead. Have you not seen the title of the game? It's she... not possible. You know she did. It's not true. There's no need to worry. If she grabs me, I'll be very upset. Everything is fine. Everything will be fine. I have to stay calm. Martha is not dead. Martha, February 26th, 1923. Why does she have that with her? Is that that's her birthday? Makes sense. Is everything okay? Are you hurt? What are you doing? Go, Eric. Run. My parents ran towards me. My mother hugged me. She, who detested me, was now cuddling me. Her warmth filled me with life, and the pain became bearable. I felt protected. Martha, are you okay? She asked me, speaking slowly in order to let me read her lips. She thought I was deaf. She thought I was Martha. I didn't want the moment to fade, so I meekly nodded my head. I didn't realize I had done something that couldn't be undone. I would Wait. have to pretend to be Martha forever. Wait, what? I mean, that's not going to work, because Martha's dead. <laughs> the body. Yikes. Sign of the cross. All right. O oh Lord who gives life to the dying, let your sacrifice of love be offered for Martha's soul. Into your hands I also entrust my spirit so that I may be reunited with her in perpetual light to never suffer the desolation of purgatory. Please grant her eternal rest, O oh Lord, and may eternal light shine upon her. So what they're saying is she's pretending to be Martha. Remember to light the candles in the hall. People will be here soon. But they think that's Julia, something but she's Julia. That's just kind of weird. Daddy must be devastated. He loves me. I messed up and now I have to watch him suffer my death. I can at least light the candles and let him find some comfort in sleep. Okay, well, let's achievement unlock the emperor. Books, books, and more books. In our villa, there must be ten times more than even here. So are they trying to say that she killed her, or is the bad thing she's talking about? Daddy's oboe. We were preparing a really nice duet together. On the rare occasions he's at home, that is. Who the hell is that? Daddy, Mummy, and my grandparents. It seems almost impossible that father is a soldier. Mother would have been more suitable if she wasn't a woman. What? Reverse, what are you talking about? <laughs> are you talking about my profile picture? That actually was created for me by, uh, by like a graphic designer. 
No, it's not. These I think you might be mistaken. Are not daddies. He never went hunting. Nanny must have left them here. I didn't add shit. This painter was a friend of Grandpa's. I always loved his paintings. As a child, I used to look at them for hours. Anything else to interact with the phone? There's no reason to use the phone right now. Okay, let's light. Wait. I don't want to leave right away. Daddy's canes. They are so beautiful, but I can't say why, but they have always scared me. I mean, I don't understand why she doesn't just say, why didn't she didn't just go, hey, that's actually Martha in there. Not Julia. When you're done, can you come and get the flowers, please? Or send Martha if you like. <sighs> Never a moment's peace. Even at a time like this. She can't sit still for a second. I'll have to look that up, Leo, because I... I've never even heard of that guy. It's frustrating, though. I guess not. I don't need that right now. You sure? You don't want to go for a quick bike ride? When Mummy asks for something, there's no escaping it. I don't like that the audio is is super like super quiet. Like some stuff's quiet, some stuff is loud. It's it's really it's unbalanced. It's all completely maxed out though. You know what I mean? So sometimes the speaking is like right now guys, my stream is maxed out for it doesn't get any louder than this. That's what's annoying. It's Everything always has to be perfect with her. The hell is that shit? Okay, what am I doing with these flowers? Oh, the other side. Right, right, right. Okay. I knew about that. What's happening? Who closed the door? Oh my god, I'm sorry. I have to pause this. I have to pause this. Someone actually thinks... Oh, I can't even zoom in. I cannot believe... <laughs> How stupid. <laughs> I just looked up Dark Viper just to see what they were talking about. Uh, I'm just trying to find his logo. That's his fucking logo. You can see how my his is copyrighted, and it looks exactly like my logo, which I had designed, done by a designer. That apparently is exactly the same. All I did was add glasses, according to that guy. I'm sorry, <laughs> that is just so stupid. <laughs> Number one, the guy doesn't even look like me, just because we have uh, like we both have beards. That is hilarious, guy. I thought it would be like similar, like in style. It's not even the same style. <laughs> Come on, man, shut the fuck up. Are you kidding me? I thought it was like gonna be similar in some crazy coincidence. It's not even close. <laughs> I've had this logo that I think since I can't remember, man. Do you think it's appropriate? Like 2014, 13? It's been reworked over the years. Yes. I must have fallen asleep. Copyrighted. What, what a stupid thing to about? say. My god. You have a beard? That's not allowed. You cop you you're copying him because you have a beard. Fuck <laughs> off. That's you so narrow-minded. 
Why don't you go to bed? Uh, no, go no. I want to stay with my daughter. Your daughter? Your daughter? You have another daughter, you know. The one who's still alive. Remember? What are you talking about, Irena? Julia is dead. What kind of comment is that? How can you? You should be thinking about Martha. Julia harmed Martha. You know that, right? And as if that were not enough, she has now also abandoned her. It's the same old story. Everything is always Julia's fault, isn't it? Her fault for Martha being deaf and for you being infertile. Do you think it's the right time for this? Julia is dead, Irena. Dead. Someone killed her. Do you realize that? Of course I realize. I get it. Do you think I'm stupid? No one understands it better than me. She always brought problems. Only problems. It would have been better if she hadn't been born at all. You're crazy. I'm the crazy one? Jesus Christ. Me? I'm sorry, but I... I as a parent, I have even if you had twins... Get at me. Yes. Your death is all my fault. All I could ever do for you was hurt you, Julia. My poor, sweet, crazy girl. What will I do without you? What will life be like now? All the time I didn't spend with you. But now I'm home. We can go fishing together. We can take pictures of butterflies. No. We can't do anything together anymore. Can we? Nothing. I miss you, Julia. I miss you. As I was saying, I know most parents, I'd say like all parents who have twins or triplets or whatever. I'm trying to fucking say something. God damn it. I feel like they would know what their daughters or sons would look like, you know? Even if they look the same, a parent knows. There's like certain things about... Like, because even though they might look similar or look the, like identical... Or they are identical. There's going to be features about them that are different. So I don't think the ruse of being Martha would really work that long. You know what I mean? I don't know. That's just me. State the peaceful towns within the Elsa Valley. We have heard some tragic news from the area of La Ramola. The young daughter of German Army General Erich K. Oh, he's a general. Near her home. What possible reason could there have been behind such a cowardly act? This is what the Carabinieri, who immediately intervened, Hope to find out. Now, Mrs. I gotta say, you've told me, like, I need to shave. Like, I don't know how many times you've told me to shave over the years. I remember you Mother said that didn't so many seem times. To suffer from the situation. You really All hate she facial cared hair, about don't you? Was that my death was so painful for Martha. But not having me around anymore must have been a great relief to her. At the end of the day, it was better for everyone that it was me who died. And it was better for me, too, that people thought that. But the guilt began to consume me. That's when I started having horrible nightmares. It's more than two times. It's way more than two times. Oh. Martha has found... No. Martha... Lost my ah, oh, you fucker. Martha has lost her life. Oh, I was gonna say it's probably soul. You fuck.
Whoa, what the fuck is up with their face? It's always the bad thing. Her. It's a nightmare, so you gotta think of I stole her. It's probably life. Oh god damn it. I stole. I thought it'd be life, that sounds like more dramatic. Her identity. do I don't want to do this dude I don't want to oh she's cutting her face off bro she's gonna cut her face off oh my god I don't I, I have to do it why you do it I don't want to oh my I have to cut it oh my god I'm cutting her face off stop oh my god no 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 I have to do it no stop Fucking cut it out! I don't want to do this! I'm cutting her fucking face off! Oh, stop! Oh my... Oh, no! No! Oh, shit! Oh, God, I'm doing this! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh my god, bro. <coughs> yeah, that is some leather face shit right there. Oh my god. Why on earth? <laughs> I can understand why PlayStation cut that, but... I was honestly just about to say, I don't understand. I haven't seen anything that dramatic that's been warranted a cut or an edit oh my god it was just a dream oh my god a horrible dream that horrendous woman and the face of my sister i wish all of this was a dream and my sister is just sleeping in her oh bed. my goodness instead her bed is empty and this is reality that was pretty pretty nasty shit <laughs> this is martha and me at the festival of the patron saint it was only a few months ago, and now... Martha had asked for a picture of me to put in this frame. She wanted me to do one of those expressions of mine that made her laugh. Expressions that she couldn't quite imitate. She used to say that those were the signs of my soul. Can a photo capture the soul? Can I capture Martha's soul? Anyway, I noticed like when you get up, it, like the it, 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 the frame rate's kind of chop. Like it'll chop and then it'll be fine. But I'm gonna try going uh, ultra performance on the DLSS. Oh, well, I don't want quality. Let's. I mean, I do, but let's go ultra performance. I've heard. This is Martha's trinket box. It could contain something that will help to figure out what happened. I see. So this is probably where we come back, you know? Martha's clothes. 
To me, wearing them will be like having her with me. Mummy will also be happy to see them. Or I could wear my clothes in the other wardrobe. So this is, this is, okay, I wonder if there's multiple endings. If she plays, okay, so here's an interesting concept. Um, so this is Martha's clothes. They think, so they think Martha's alive. So this would draw the most least suspicion. But I could also wear Julia's clothes, who is dead. So it's almost like, uh, you know, either, you're, I don't know. It's, it could honestly almost change the ending. It's July 18th. Yes, Tenzel, I did. I completed it yesterday. I always keep my trinket box locked. Yeah, I heard about that, Vicky. There's been a few things they cut, so. Oh, gosh, if Mummy sees this picture, she'll throw it away for sure. It's me and Lapo. I want to see him as soon as possible so we can mourn Martha's death together. Nanny will be visiting me soon. What the hell? I looked down and she looks up. I was like, what the fuck? Okay. My dress. The one Martha wore when she was... Ooh, don't wear that. Do not wear that, whatever you do. Can I be Martha without her clothes? Mummy never wanted us to swap, so I don't know how she will take it. I could wear Martha's clothes instead, in the other wardrobe. I wonder if it matters, though. Like, the thing is, I wonder if it's, like, bad enough for her to, like, wear her sister's clothes. You know, pretend to be something she's not. She keeps getting these, like, um, she keeps getting these, like, visions or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. I'm trying to think. May I, should I keep the ruse up? No, I think they meant, I think Martha was meant to die, but she just took the chance and like, since she was not liked by her mother, her mother doesn't like Julia, but her father does. So it's like, they clearly have their favorites. I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I want to, mom is kind of mean. I don't know, bro. What's that? Scary fairy tales. Everything seems to be scary lately. Yet everything here is so beautiful and bright. Hey, sheep. Okay, let's just look at which is nicest. Okay, let's actually look at the clothes and see which one's nicest. And that's how I'm going to make my call. To be honest, I prefer the white and the purple on the other side. Alright, let's go with the purple blouse. Why not? Okay, mix and match, dog. The magician achievement. Are oh, you not gonna let me? Out of curiosity, I want to see what that says. Let me open up the Steam. I want to see what the achievement was. The magician dressed in Martha's clothes. Seventy percent dressed in Martha's clothes. Well, seventy-seven percent of people have the achievement. That doesn't mean anything. So I, if I picked something else, I would have got a different achievement. I wonder how it affects things. It must have a different ending if you, like... Everything I need is always in my bag. It's like, yes, you're you're playing up with the ruse. You have Julia Julia's bag. Here you find objects that Julia always carries with her along. And you picked up during the game. Isn't it Martha's bags? Objects are listed at the bottom left. Select objects to analyze it. Now try selecting the key or the map. All right, let's try the map. Right, because this is where the body was... Oh, no, this is where the body was found. Out here. So this is their manor. Okay. The log. Okay. So B to open the bag. The key to my trinket box. Oh. So wait. Her trinket box. Here is my diary. July 12th, 1944. This is a new diary. We moved here today and I forgot my old one back at home. But that's okay. A new chapter in my life, a new diary. No one's gonna read it. They say they brought us here for our own safety. Daddy, the war, and everything else. 
Nanny gave us her house and she went to look after the mansion. It's weird being back here after so many years. I remember Nanny telling me the fairy tale of the Lady of the Lake. It's one of the few happy memories I have from when I was little. Nanny isn't here and that's a shame, but Martha is here with me. I also get to see Lapo more often, which is wonderful. He's always hanging around here. Mum is thankfully too preoccupied with fixing up the house to worry about me. At least for now. July 16th, 1944. There's something creepy about the woods. Every time I'm at the lake, I get a strange feeling. Maybe it's the legend of the white lady playing tricks on me. I get weird ideas. I think that there is this presence. Then I think I'm just being crazy. Anyway, crazy or not, I want to take some pictures. I'm not scared. In fact, I'd say I'm excited. I've made arrangements with her. <laughs> She's coming to the lake with me tomorrow to set up two new cameras with timers, and we'll see what we can photograph. Not before a good swim, of course. <laughs> to be honest, Martha doesn't like photography all that much, and recently she's gone off swimming too. But she does like spending time with me by teasing me. Then, when she gets bored, she disappears into her books, and I do my own thing. We feel right when we're together. So do you think they actually were together at that time? And then she just ended up drowning, but she sounds surprised. Man, I should have black sheeped it. Fine. I should have dressed up as Julia. What do you think? What did you say? This is not the right key. Okay, okay. I must I get her key if I want to know what's inside her trinket box. They really think I'm Martha and I can't hear them. I need to be careful not to talk, or I will be in serious trouble. Oh, right, because Martha never talked. Because she's deaf, right? Yeah, because Martha was deaf. That was the difference. All right, well, let's leave then. Okay, look at it, please. Look at it. How wonderful the snow is. Unfortunately, it doesn't snow often around here. So I'm not supposed to to keep up with the to keep up with the ruse. But the thing is, I feel like a morning sister might actually want to be surrounded in her sister's thing. So it, it almost makes sense to wear Julia's thingamajig. You know what I'm saying? Jace, thanks so much for that super chat, big player. Appreciate you. How, it turns you around mad quick. There's actually a lot of, like, look on the right side of the screen. Look at that. You see that? Look at that flicker. So there's a few bugs in this game. Hi, Byron. Hey, Jason. Obviously. Jesus Christ, it's Jason Brown. As a child, when I spent those short years with the nanny, this was my room. It's so locked. You... Strange. Why did they lock my room? Because you know they think you did. Hey, stop. Martha's breakfast. Oh my god, look at the frame rate. Holy shit. Yes, yes. It's getting late. Looks like Did ass. Did you read the newspaper for Martha? You know how much she likes reading it. Yes, Irena. It's on the table. Can't you see? And that camera? Are you leaving it there? Yes, Irena. Can't you leave it there for a few more days? Do you mind? It was for Yulia. I will take it away soon. I, I promise. The sword makes me so sad. Seeing it there is as if... I don't know how to explain it. All right, all right, all right. But let's go now. We have too much to do. We can't stay here all day talking. Maria, thank you for the Mommy super chat. Right, I appreciate Martha you. Martha always read everything. It means a lot. It's me who will now read the newspaper instead. They'll be out all day. Holy Human shit. Preparations will take them a long time. You guys are just elbow dropping Everything the super chats is today. Complex with the war. Shaheed, the thank you, bro. Appreciate days, you. I will see little to nothing of them. Crazy how far you've come, bro, since 2011. Hell yeah. Oh, fuck, man. Crazy. 2011. I mean, honestly, I've actually been making content since uh, 2008. Seven, technically. But I started doing this in 2010. Anyway, read the newspaper. 
Okay. So these are objectives, I see. I must put one of my photos in this empty frame. I always said to Martha I would, but never did. She would have liked it so much. During deep winter, I would go to sleep snuggled by the fire and Nanny would get angry. Do you want to turn into a piece of charcoal, Julia? Brutal assassination in San Casciano. Julia Kay, a young woman from a respectable family, brutally murdered near her home. But how was she murdered? It doesn't say, does it? A possible political motive emerges. Does Martha it... was not killed by politics or war. She was killed by something much closer and much less clear. I will find out the truth. Okay. Brutal assassination oh, wait, in no, no. San Casciano. I don't need you to read the same thing. Firm bulwark, even in the skies. 159 aircraft of the Germanic defense shot down in 24 hours. Major Russian operation northwest of Jassy. Enemy convoy lost in the Mediterranean. Two destroyers and six merchant vessels sunk. No, it's not free to play. It's not too expensive. I think it's like 25 US or something like that. Julia K. Distressed but supported by faith. Irene E, the mother, Erich the father, and Martha the sister sadly announce Julia's passing. The funeral will take place in La Romola, Thursday, July 20th at 9.30 p.m., departing from the property of the deceased. First improvements in food registration. Bread rations increased by 50 grams per day as of April 20th. A kilo more every month of soup ingredients reforms to the treatment of agricultural workers and an unexpected distribution of jam. Hmm. What's up, Tito? For Julia to take more and more photos, Dad. For Julia to take more and more photos, Dad. Yoink. I can verify that the camera is still working by taking a photo. I could photograph a sparrow. There are so many of them out here. Grab the film. Chocolate. Oh, it's chocolate. That was film. <laughs> chocolate. There might be birds around the little wall in front of the house. I always put crumbs on it for them. True, but let's first, let's snoop around. I liked watching Nanny as she cooked. Man, it's dark and dingy in here. I up loads of techniques. I don't like how dark and dingy it is. I'm getting out. I'm getting out of here. Oh, right. Audrey Bonsi. On the day of St. Alexis, the battle rages in the city Florence, of July 15, 1944. General Erich K. As per our prior agreement, we are sending you military encrypted communication material. The device must remain hidden and secret. Hail. Feld Mascheralo, Carl H. What the hell? The moment I thought I saw... No, no, that's not possible. It must be this whole situation making me see things that don't exist. Honestly, man, I don't know if I'd be able to have a loved one just kind of hanging out. You know what I mean? Yeah, this game has some pretty bad frame rate issues. What if I should save and reload with ray tracing off? The only way people could tell Martha and me apart was by dressing differently. Even Mother couldn't tell us apart. Which is pretty bad, to be fair. Did you see it? Look at this. I see what they're doing. Martha's on top. Julia's on the bottom. Martha's in this elegant gold frame. And Julia's in this brown, like, wooden, not as flashy. It looks dull. Like, you can clearly tell. Mommy and Daddy. They are the epitome of wealth and elegance. But pain pays no heed to money and style. Okay, well, anyway... What's downstairs? You're so lucky. 
In these difficult times, pantries are empty and people are going hungry. But with a German general for father, food is never scarce. Lorenzini haberdashery, five meters of gray cotton fabric, six meters of white linen fabric, four Hounds meters do. of green satin, delivered on June 5th, 1944. In the event of an issue, contact us on the number 6987. And this red 69. fabric, it's not been mentioned. Could this also be one of mummies or could the nanny have left it here? Mummy's medicine. Will they do her any good? Mummy's sewing machine. She learnt how to sew because nobody else could do it to her liking. These could be of use to me. Let me guess. You're going to somehow accidentally stab somebody. Or we're going to go upstairs and you're going to cut off your sister's hair. So what the fuck? That better be wine. Our wine. Daddy is so proud of it. You just don't finish the job? That's gonna stain. We're gonna need a mop. I see the I see the dark room. These workbenches fascinate me. I would love to learn carpentry. Man, this game lags like a this bag of shit, Nanny's doesn't it? This is husband made my dolls. Look at that! How laggy it is. That's so fucking bad. Holy shit! The puppets I used to play with were made here. I never knew that when I was a child. They always told me that a fairy bought them. I didn't really believe them, but it was nice to think that. Man, it's dark as hell. Is there any way we can get a flat? Oh, wait, no. I was just going to say, where's the flashlights? I'm like, it's 1944. You have lanterns. No, you did have, like, flashlights, but most people... Well, they might. I don't know. The dark room. Daddy set up his darkroom here. He doesn't take photos anymore because of his work, but photography is still his true passion. I'm allowed to use the darkroom when I want to. So I'm assuming I have to go take a picture of the sparrow and then process the film. That is a major part of this game, believe it or not. There are three baths when developing photos. The development bath, then the first rinse, and then the fixing bath. The second rinse is done directly in the sink. So afterwards. boom, 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 boom. Before I can use the enlarger, I should take a photo. Daddy had this device brought here last week. It's old, but still works. He has always loved everything technological. No thanks, Emmanuel. I don't know you anything. Okay, oh, well, this is the... Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. Okay, let's go outside. Let's actually take the picture. I was jumping the gun a little bit. It does look quite beautiful, though. I mean, look at it. All right, where's the sparrow? Wow, oh, sparrow. Here we go. Oh, do I have to actually have to take it out? I see. You're about to use Julius' camera to 40 roll a cord with a 120 millimeter. You'll use it to take photos throughout the game. Some photos will have hell on elements that'll progress the game. Sorry, cool. Nikon will appear. No camera skin. The base camera. Okay, stop observing. Look for the subject. You're about to take your first picture. Yeah. Simplify the simulation. The picture preview displays the settings as you change them on your camera. In real life, the viewfinder's image is controlled by the secondary lens and only responds to focus. Okay. Whoa, shit. I didn't mean to rotate. No, stop, stop rotating. <laughs> okay, R and F is height. That's weird. Okay, R and F is height. That's fucking bizarre to me. Okay, zooming in.
Okay, prepare. Okay. If you stand still, you'll be able to fine tune the. Okay. You want me to go up? It says it's out of focus. Oh, you hit continue. Show adjustments panel. Make your unique pic your picture unique. Use the panel's controls to adjust focus, exposure, and aperture. I don't know if I want tons of exposure. Extra. All the camera's add-ons. Film. After closing the window, adjust the camera and press space to shoot. Properly exposed. Can we zoom in? I don't want to get a picture of the bird's ass. I want to try and... I kind of want to rule of thirds it, but I need to zoom in if I'm going to do that. I say... Why does it say out of focus? Oh, there's your focus. Okay, my bad. Now it's in focus. Yes, okay, go back now. Okay, now we should be good. I wish we could zoom in a little more. What's with the fucking lag? Oh my god. It's, it doesn't... Because it's a keyboard. Try that. It's not going to be that good, but... The sun achievement. You've taken first photo. You can shoot as many photos as you want throughout the game, but remember that only a few will be critical to the story's progress. Soon you will learn how to take develop the photos. All right, let's Excellent. go back. Excellent. I've taken the picture. Now it's straight to the dark room. In the Bye. Straight to the dark room as I go right over here. This Daddy family has got a lot of money. Daddy a general in the German army. He used to take pictures on the front lines, but now he gives me the materials to take photographs instead. Now that Martha is gone... Only this camera can fix my ideas. How much do you think this memories. bitch is worth? I can't allow myself to forget. I'm actually not um into Elden Ring. Bread, butter, jam, and coffee. Martha's typical breakfast. I, I mean that I'm not milk, really it doesn't interest me as I'll have to adapt to her other tastes, people are obviously. into. Honestly, that's an interesting thought. I'm going to go do that as well. Yes, I will do that. It is creepy, but... Did I look at these? These are our vineyards. My father loved them so much that he constantly took photos of them. Okay. Okay, Martha, let's take a picture. Yikes. That'll be very bizarre. She did have a purple bruise. Yeah, that's true. Like, why would she... If she just drowned, wouldn't... Like, she must have been hit in the head with something. That's the thing. Like, obviously. This seems like it's an interview place, but I guess it's... Who the fuck knows? I, I feel like the family knows more than, than they let on, you know? I just have that creepy suspicion that the family is, like, sussy-ass bacas. All right, develop a photo. You'll first have to use the enlarger. The enlarger is an optical instrument that allows you to process photographic paper. After sh shooting a photo, the film must be developed in several steps. This aspect has been admitted for the sake of simplicity, but in reality, the steps are as follows. The film is firstly rolled on a reel and put inside a small tank. 
The tank is then immersed in the developer, washed, and then immersed in a stop bath. It is then washed again, dried, and finally cut. You'll find your rolls of film ready to... So it's skipping a process just for video game's sake, but it's telling... It's basically saying photography buffs. Yes, we know that's not how you actually do it, but we're doing it to save time. Large allows you to customize your photo even more. You can choose which part of the paper the picture will be printed. Just the focus and choose how long to expose the photographic paper. With the red filter, you can project to see the image on the paper you're exposing it. Use the controls to move the paper on the bench and adjust the magnification and focus. When the three circles are aligned, the picture is focused. If you still see the image out of focus when aligned, you probably shot it, shot it that way. Play with the adjustment until you're happy. When you're ready, press space to continue. I got a bit of flowers in there. I'm wondering if I should like a little bit of flower action. But she's got to be the she's got to be the subject. Oh, well, what happened? Sorry, my stream's lagging. What the hell? Can you guys see me? My stream is red all of a sudden. Fuck, what happened? It's telling me I'm getting experiencing issues. It says it's in the red, so I don't understand. It says I'm in the red. I don't want it to stop. It's not lagging or anything? You guys can hear and see me fine? Like, everything's good? Well, I was looking right. I'm, I mean, I'm still here. I was just not looking. So it might be frozen solid because I was just looking at the chat. Are we sure it's fully frozen? Fuck. I can't save. Oh my god, what the fuck? Okay, I'm gonna quit. Hold on. I don't know what's going on with the stream. Okay. Let's try that. Hold on. Uh, uh, it's green now. It's green. I'll wait. Okay, hold on. Stream is green and now. Let me know. I think the problem is they're so fucking behind. I can't get an accurate rendition. You know what I mean? Like the stream is like 15 seconds behind. Okay. So the game was lagging the shit out. I'm going to. Uh, okay, cool. All right. So here's what's going to happen. I'm going to play this in the recommended version. There's an RTX recommended one. And I'm not doing that because it's so laggy. The game was lagging the piss out of it. So I think that's what happened. I saw my stream went into the went into the red. The problem is chat is so behind of what actually is happening. By the time you actually hear what I say, it happened like depending on the situation, sometimes it's 15 to 20 seconds behind. So it's like I can't get an answer. The game was lagging it. So hopefully this is smoother this time. So we'll continue. I might have to reopen the development process. I don't know where it's saved. So hopefully it's not going to do that again. There might be birds around the little oh, fuck you. of the house. I always put crumbs on it for them. It didn't save any of it. Wait, why is that swinging? That's a little weird. Yeah, I don't need to. Thank you. I, I wish it saved. See, I was going to save it, but then it was lagging like a fuck. So, naturally. It's 
This might be a better photo, actually. Oh, that Excellent. sucked. I've I didn't like that. Now it's straight to the dark I hated that one. Oh, that he moved at the wrong time. Daddy recently became a general in the German army. He used to take pictures on the front lines. So do I have to re now he like gives me the materials to take photographs instead? Do I have now to re go that Martha through is gone, only this camera can fix my ideas and my memories. Wouldn't it be funny if the I game just lagged because it's like I tried to take a picture of Martha. It's like Martha's dead though. <laughs> On the day of Saint Alexis, the battle rages. Florence, July 15th. That's annoying. Sorry, guys. See, I was able to save. I should have backed Four. out and saved General before I went in. As per our prior agreement, we are sending you military encrypted communication material. The device must remain hidden and secret. Hail. Feld Mascheralo, Carl H. I mean, he was part of the Nazi party. Moment I thought I saw Take a picture of that. No, that's not possible. It must be this whole situation making me see things that don't exist. Photographs don't lie, so I'm gonna try and frame those flowers. See how I'm framing the flowers a little bit? We need aperture, we need quite the brightness. That might actually be a better photo. Maybe. We'll see what happens. Just whatever you do, Martha, do not move. We do not care. We are so lucky. In these difficult times, pantries are empty and people are going hungry. But with a German general for a father, food is never scarce. Lorenzini had I wish you could skip it, but you can't. Five meters of gray cotton fabric. Six meters of white linen fabric. Four meters of green satin. Delivered on June 5th, 1944. In the event of an issue, contact us on the number 6987. And this red fabric? It's not been mentioned. Could this also be one of Mummy's, or could the nanny have left it here? Mummy's medicine. So wouldn't they, they, do uh, uh, they, wouldn't they be speaking German then? I know they're in Italy, but wouldn't they be speaking German? Mummy's sewing machine. She you know learned what I mean? how to sew because nobody else could do it to her liking. These could be of use to me. Yes, they can. Our wine. Okay, Daddy I think that's all the so conversations. I don't think there's anything over here. We'll walk over here, though, just to be safe. When I was little, these barrels seemed enormous. I thought I could live inside one. Um, I think I missed that, actually. Okay, I'm going to save. Good. All right, let's go develop. Daddy yeah. set up his dark. It room was here. Germany, Italy. He doesn't take Japan. photos anymore because of his work, but photography is still his true passion. I'm allowed to use the dark room when I want to. There are three baths when developing photos: the development bath, then the first rinse, and then the fixing bath. The second rinse is done directly in the sink afterwards. <clears throat> sorry. Daddy had this device brought here last week. It's old, but it still works. He has always loved everything technological. All right, let's develop this bitch. Because the thing is, if Julia was the photographer and not Martha, if they found out she was taking photos... You know what I'm saying? It'd be a little concerning.
Do I have to do that? See, so yeah, me being further back would have... Oh, there you go. I can't develop the photo like this. When the red filters move, the image is exposed under the paper. Okay. And made faster. I've used the dark room like once in my life in high school. They actually show you how to do it like old school. It's been so long though since I've done it. To achieve ideal exposure, take the paper out of the developer when the timer's in the green zone. If you take the paper out too early, the picture will be ruined. Are you fucking serious? And stop. Real life immersion of the developer is followed by a watch. Watch stop rather than a second watch. Have been skipped. Okay. Here's your printed photo! You can keep it or album or scrap it. I think we'll keep it. I mean, that's actually kind of a pretty photo, honestly. Now what? I'm gonna... Let's develop this. We'll zoom right in on the Beardo. Oh, it's flapping its fucking wings, dog. Look at that. Usually I'm all about rule of thirds. I, I like rule of thirds a lot. I think it makes a photo look great, but in this case, we're probably gonna center it. I can't develop the photo like this. Why? Card out of position? I can't develop the Why? photo like this. Oh, you have to back it up? I can't develop Fuck. the photo like this. There. It's probably not going to look as good as I wanted, but... Skip. <laughs> actually, that might look cool. That actually is kind of nice. It's, it's not ideal. It I wish it was a bit closer, but works perfectly. I had to do that photo for me to progress. Take a self-time so. photo for Martha's frame. Oh man, the Herophant. I've already taken a picture of Martha. They're not gonna count that. <laughs> Why? Now that I know, now go take a picture of Martha. Oh no, she said self time, so she's gonna take a selfie. Can we choose where we take it? Probably right here. This looks like a tripod. Did I look at this already? These workbenches. No, I didn't. I forgot to. Well, I did. But... I would love to learn carpentry. This is where Nanny's husband made save. my dolls. The puppets I used to play with were made here. Creepy. I never knew that when I was a child. They always told me that a fairy bought them. I didn't really believe them, but it was nice to think that. Now make sure you show as little emotion as physically possible. Camera is set up with the self-timer. This is how you take photos in the old days. But you have to like sit there and like look proper at the same time. Now we do stupid shit. Like. You know what I'm saying? Like here's an old picture of grandma. Oh hey kids. Here's an old picture of grandma. <laughs> like what? That's like, that's like current. That's like Gen Z. Slash millennials. That's what our uh old pictures are gonna look like 
<laughs> For no reason, it'll be like, oh god, what is that? What was Grandma doing? Sweetheart, that was called twerking. Let's smile. Be happy. All right, let's take a look. Can you imagine sulking? Wait, smiling? Oh, shit, bro. Smiling is bad. Oh, no. Can I take a new photo, please? I should have smiled. Dude, no one would be... We're mourning. I forgot. We're fucking mourning. We're mourning. But maybe... You know what? Maybe a happy photo would be what the your sister would want. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. We'll see in a second. It's always a thrill to develop a photo. You can't see anything at first. Ah! Oh, it's so scary. Every time it's in negative. That invisible breath then returns to reveal the reality from which it was torn. Oh, there are those who say that photography steals the soul or captures it. I don't That's like why that they photo. Used to photograph the dead. But nowadays, almost nobody does it anymore. Even if it's just a delusion, I want to photograph Martha. I want to have a small reflection of who she was with me. But I have to do it secretly or they'll think I'm crazy. Try and center it. God, whenever you're in negative, it just looks like sinister shit. I kind of wonder if I should ruin it just so I don't... Okay, that's... That's better. That's better. Yes, this is me. No one was ever able to tell us apart. But I never had the slightest doubt, and nor did Martha. It's strange how what identifies us most deeply is She is wearing the purple blouse. Look. Remember it had dots on it? That's cool. I was obsessively thinking about Martha and what had happened. But suddenly, the thought took control. The memory of that day at the lake was becoming more and more like a dream when, after awakening, the image becomes more and more faded. Could it be that the memories were a figment of the mind? Had I been the one that hurt my sister? I had always envied her and now I had taken her identity. I experienced a suffocating pattern of thoughts. I decided to go straight to the lake to retrieve the film rolls. They would tell a different story, I was sure. But deep down, I kept hoping they would confirm my fading memory. One thing I wish I did do was the door is locked. get into photography when at a younger age. As usual, then they will I have I have an study. interest in it now. We live in fear now. Like my I don't have not going to let me go to the lake anymore after Martha's death. So this is the right time. I need to know. The self-doubt I feel is eating me up. What I was trying to say is, um, for the rolls. I wonder if I should be on the other side of the map. Because I'm kind of blocking the lighter. Let's put me over here. Let's try that. Maybe that'll be a little better. I know I'm in the way of a loading screen, but who cares? The little loading sign, no one gives a shit about that. But anyway, I, I mean, I, I have an interest in it now. I would love to, like, actually get in take my own photos, like... I like learning about it and seeing the cool shit, but, you know, shit's expensive. July 18th. New diary. Everything what are you writing? Changed. I feel like a different person. The best part of me left with Martha. My enthusiasm, my desire to live, and the will to joke around. I find myself alone, left to my own devices. Confused with no desire or expectations. I was handling the cameras at the lake and there was a floating body on the water. I don't remember what I was doing before. Yet another memory lapse. That lifeless body was Martha's. My sister. Mummy ran up to me and hugged me thinking I was Martha and that I, Julia, was dead. I didn't correct her mistake and now it's too late. If they find out I've been fooling everyone, I don't even want to think about it. I feel terribly guilty pretending to be Martha, pretending to be death. I took the photo for Martha's frame. 
I know it's too late now, and I felt incredible pain placing the picture. I said goodbye to her forever in that moment. I realized she was gone, and there was no going back. I must do one thing for Martha. I must find out what happened. Partisans couldn't have killed her. That's just ridiculous. Lapo is my friend, and he is one of them. He loved us so much. We know all of them, so it's just impossible. Okay, what's my objective? I've already taken her photo! Bullshit! Fine. It's dark and I can't turn on the lights. It's dangerous. I'll need a flash for the camera. I can look for it amongst Daddy's things in the room below his bedroom. No one would know. What the hell was that? Wait, do you think it'll be in the dark room? Must be. Why do you have to close the door? What's this? A, a lens, lens and a roll of infrared film. They can photograph what the naked eye cannot see. With this lens, I can shoot very close up. Good. Orange filter. When there is fog, it improves the image by giving it some contrast. Blue filter. Ideal for indoor photos. Okay. Fair enough. That makes sense. A tripod is necessary to take photos with long exposures. Okay. It's so I damn found dark. I need to take infrared photos. Oh, shit. Every, I hate how every time you have to activate the lighter. Gotta remember though, this isn't a um, this is not a typical horror game. It's not it's not necessarily jump scary. It's psychological. That's one thing people have to understand. Psychological thor horror is all up in here. It all has to do with messed up imagery, disturbing moments, things like that. I don't have the courage to use the phone, not right now. Okay. I wouldn't. Again, I wouldn't be taking a photo of. Okay, what's going on here? Why can't I use that? I thought... What's my current... Do I have an objective? Objective here. Cameras at the lake. I'll have my old cameras at the lake. I should go get them. They should can contain important information. You need a key. Find the camera flash. So I don't have a flash yet. Okay, why does that say objective? Maybe we'll go back to the newspaper then. Oh, maybe it just didn't... Why did it do that? Sometimes you'll get, like, spun around. This room we never actually got to investigate. There's the front door key. Must be. What's this? Is that a flash? Here's the camera. There you flash. go. Now I can photograph Martha even in the dark. Dude, something's going to go down.
daddy stuff. War maps. I've heard everything will play out on this new defensive line. Yeah, well, spoiler alert, it didn't work. I shouldn't risk it really, but I love watching them sleep. It's the only time they are together and not fighting. That's kind of creepy in its own way. I better not though. Imagine just taking a picture of them. You trip. Oh shit, pussy fart. <laughs> Hey, where art thou? Wait, this is her room at the end, right? Right, well, that's where they are anyway. That's the front. So that's where we... I don't know. Wait, hold on. So this objective... I mean, we'll go with that. We'll take a photo first. I mean, I would be so fucking creeped out. I'm just saying, I would not want her down here. Not, not, no disrespect, but like. Alright, I can't see shit. Alright, it's too dark. Extras, um. The flash. Okay, subject is framed. Very short distance. That'll be better. Not good for that. Um, standard film. I kind of want to do an infrared shot. You never know what we're going to see. I have a feeling we're going to see shit. Oops. Now we'll take the exact same photo we've already taken, but this one will be a little better. I'm scared. Done. It would be nice to have you always by my side. Dude, I've already, just I already did that. Now we got to redevelop that. So now we have two photos, one during the day, one during the night. And then we got to go down to the lake. I have a feeling this is a better... Yikes. A photograph is both the present and the past. Like a dead body. I don't know what I'm expecting. Maybe it's silly to think you can capture the soul of someone who has died. Well, we'll see what happens with that lens. Make sure we take it out at the right time, guys, or we're going to be... Oh, the exposure is different on this one. Her face can no longer tell me if what happened was my Kind of fault. a shitty photo. I should have known that already. All I can do is head to the lake and get those rolls. It's kind of pretty in its own way. It's like a peaceful thing. It looks like she's sleeping, you know? Like, you know, but with the flowers in there. All right, now we got to go down to the lake. It's fucking pitch black, y'all. Follow me down to the river. Drink where the water is clean. 
Follow me down to the river, man. I'll be down here on my knees. I liked watching Nanny as she cooked. What's this? I always picked up loads of techniques. New skin. Oh, new skins! Yes, bitch! Yes! We got ourselves a skin. It's our first camera skin. Alright, I don't really want to go out in the day. Or the night. What's this? A lantern. That's better. Now we Gucci. What's up, Chris? Alright, let's look at the map. So, we gotta find the route, which is... This way? Or is that a river? Like, I don't know what the... No, no that's a road. Don't want to go down that road. Which eventually will lead... Okay, those cameras, they're all there. So we have to... We're actually going on a bit of a walk. So I think I want to go this way. Where am I? Maybe not. How do I get down there? Oh, you didn't have any washing machines? Broke ass bitch. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Obviously, I'm kidding. Some of you are like, Dan, that's fucking mean. 1944. Jesus. Generator. Saddles. I was afraid of animals when I was little. I never approached them alone. But now what do you do? Do you approach them? Okay, which way? Let's check the map. So that way it goes up to the house again. I'm gonna actually go over here because I don't know if there's a way down here. Maybe I'll find like something to pick up, like a skin or a garage. Oh, they have a garage. Actually, that's an invisible wall. So I mustn't be allowed to go that way. Which is interesting, because it looks like there's a quick... Damn it! Really? There was a step down? Oh, I'm such a jackass. Okay, where is... Sorry, I'm already lost. Right. I love the night, but this night scares me. In the dark, I can feel all the harm I've caused. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I don't feel that scared right now. It's getting closer with each step. I know this I isn't the way. It brushing up against me like a cold wind. I hurt Martha. The closer I get to the lake, the more certain I am of this. How could it not be? I killed her to steal the love that everyone felt for her. But I don't think so. Me. I think that's what it's meant to believe, but I don't think that's the case. Thing? You didn't. I don't think it was you. I'm thinking it was mom. They've said many times that mom couldn't tell them apart and she had her dress on. So do you think maybe that mom went Wu tanged, you know, Julia, thinking it was Julia, but it was Martha this whole fucking time? And have you noticed how after Julia died, she's all like, pay attention to your daughter or whatever. It's like, what's this? What's playing backwards? Do you hear that? Another entrance, maybe? Something where we can't access just yet. Let's check the maps. Yeah, see, this was a detour. I just wanted to see it. You never know what's over here. I figured I'd go over here now. I know the objective is telling me to go elsewhere. I'm sure I will have to go somewhere eventually, but... like, Or I'll, that'll probably be a part of the story, but... What's that? Here's the bridge.
Oh, hello. Okay, we're in the new zone. There is a left turn. Hold on. A little confused here. Let's see where this goes. It's just a dead end. So, does this entire game literally just take place on their property? It must. The music's getting eerier the more the closer we get to the lake. For good reason. So we're Hello. going down. Damn lamp. Oh shit. Luckily I still have my lighter with me. Okay, now our <gasps> Okay, hi. <laughs> Not scared. <laughs> Sorry guys, I was I, I sneezed. Excuse me. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Sorry, that's, that's how I sneeze. My bad. Just a little sneeze, ain't nothing but a thing. Cameras are somewhere around here. This is a camera. She still got that purple blouse on. Two cameras left. New skin. Question, do I go back and then cross? Probably. All right, this is where it all went down. What's that over there? Can I even go this way? Yeah, here it is. Tell you what, I'll grab the one on the far side first, and I'll come back for that one, because that one's the one that basically ends where we were. What is that thing, and what's that red thing there? A shred of fabric here in the woods. How strange. Let's take a photo of it. One more camera to collect. I can't even see my skins. Silver. Let's roll with that. Okay. That's kind of pretty. It's out of focus. Can I... Maybe that? Uh, I, can't, I, I don't know if I want it like that. See that? That's how I want the photo. Well, maybe... You don't want it too sideways. That's kind of clean. You want it a little out of skew. How do I want it? I'm just trying to figure it out. I mean, you don't want it directly centered. I think that's good. It's a little off. Rule of thirds action. Um, let's let's show. We got to adjust the what was it? The focus, right? All right. How could it have ended up here? It looks familiar. Nice. Wait a minute, the red fabric. That's the fabric that was down in Mother's thing. Remember the hound's tooth? Remember the hound's tooth fabric? She's like, the red fabric. Where did that come from? Blah, 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 blah. Hey, Six. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you, man. Is this going to give us a camera skin as well? it I've got them all these films are going to help me understand what happened now I should rush home to develop them okay I don't like that I don't appreciate that backwards shit I could see this being a really really neat photo hold on I hate, I hate, I didn't mean to do that. I wish I could go even lower. Damn it, I keep doing, they put it in a weird spot. F and R is height. I wish I could go lower than that. Well, that's actually kind of neat. I mean, it's cool, but I don't. I, I'm not. If it's not part of the story right now, I'm not gonna bother. 
So now our... Okay, I have to head back and develop the film, yes? Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm gonna run back. Not gonna squeal. If I, if I sneeze again, I apologize. I mean, you know, allergies. So if I sneeze... You know what's up. <whistles> Sprinkle it with dew. Just sing happy songs. Cover it in chocolate and a miracle too. The candy man. The candy man can. I can't run. No, bitch. Julia. No. Ah, okay. Ah. Oh, sorry, guys. These allergies are killing me. They're killing me. Oh, am I t controlling? I'm controlling. Oh god, it's just like the, it's just like the nightmare. I don't dare look behind me. I don't dare. <laughs> Mohammed! Welcome to the membership program, brother! Appreciate it! Oh god, we're slowing down. Oh god, listen to that! Listen to that! Don't look! Oh my goodness, what is happening? I'm gonna regret this. What happens if I start going back? Nothing. You see some baggies? Amazing Grace starts playing on the bagpipes. Why am I so small? Look how- Oh, I'm a little girl again! That's why! I'm like, why am I so short? Oh, look at the casket is so small! As well. <laughs> As a grown-ass man says that. Oh shit, I'm a little girl again! Wow, it's been years! Okay! Wait, who's who's hanging? I, I was that her? I don't. Ah, okay. She's decaying, bro. That's what would happen if she sat in that living room long enough. But it would take a minute. It would take a while to do that. And she's hanged herself. Is obvious. Oh, the maggots, bro. Come on, oh, God. That gives me a. Oh, my skin. It makes it crawl. What is that? Oh, is it a baby? Oh, my. Oh, my God. What the fuck? Are we the fucking baby? Bro, we're the baby. We're <laughs> We're playing as the baby! What? Wait a minute. Ah! We're a, we're a little ass baby. Who just came out the womb. <laughs> oh my god. That was absolutely insane. Here's my thought based on that. Martha got prego. Someone knew that, and she wasn't supposed to be, so she got Wu Tang. Oh, oh what the man. fuck, dude! I see it. it. My dreams once more. Look down, girl. Maybe Look. she wants to talk to me. Tilt. Oh, what am I saying? Your My head. Tales coming true. Yet I feel. No, no. These are the thoughts of a crazy person, and I am not crazy. Girl, look at your fucking le bedding. Like, honest to. Oh! What 
Damn it, what's all this blood? I'm not due yet and there's a lot more than usual. What's happening to me? Am I going to be joining Martha sooner than I Did she thought? have the I have to fucking... rush up and do what needs to be done. If I'm sick, I have little time. Oh the fuck. truth awaits me. What is happening? It must be hidden within those rolls. Oh, man, girl. That is a lot for... Wait, it's upside down. Look, the photo's upside down. Mohammed. Thank you so much for that super chat. I appreciate you. You're a super sticker, technically. Thank you very, very much. Appreciate that. Oh, my. Okay, well... Okay. Um, can I open her thing yet? No, it's still locked. Can I open? Oh, it's already open. Sure. Oh, no, I'm not saying that's that. I don't think that's a period, though, is what she's saying. I know periods are normal. 100%. It's the next day. My point is, that wasn't a period. We just saw that Martha, or sorry, Martha, yeah. Martha had a baby, and now she's got, like, you know, a situation captain. You know what I'm saying? That could have been a miscarriage. Yeah, it's very possible. Oh, wait. Can we wear someone else's clothes? Dude, let's, let's cheese mom a little bit. Let's put on our clothes. I mean, I don't really like the colors of these two. So let's go with what this. What am puppy. I thinking? I would stain my clothes with blood. Oh, but, but Martha's clothes are totally fine. Oh, wait, do we have to own? Oh, let's try putting on Martha's clothes. What am I thinking? I would stain my clothes with blood. So do we have to go take a shower? Or something do we have to clean? She said she, we have to clean up. Thanks, Mohammed. I appreciate you. Happy to provide. Oh, is that, is that, a, that the bidet, right? Yeah, they actually, that's a bidet. I have a bidet tonight. Okay, we'll just squat and wash. Don't mind me. Do, That's better. Is that is that a, is but that normal though? Don't understand all Do people that bleed that blood? heavily? I've never. That's never happened to me before, but I'm not going to tell my doctor. Otherwise, he'll make me stay in bed and rest. And we don't want to stay in those sheets. All right, anyway, let, we're gonna like I said, we're gonna try dressing up as Julia this time. This dress is only for special occasions. Okay, fuck me then. I guess we're gonna go. I'd rather have the olive one. Personally, I don't like her wardrobe as much. I don't. I think it's the colors aren't my thing. I mean, I'll wear the colors, but it doesn't look as good. I think it's very rude, but I could pick up the phone and listen to their conversation. Well, they ain't never gonna know. How are you doing today, Renny? I'm worried, Father. Very worried. We found more partisan tracks in the woods, right next to the house. That Lapo. I suspect he may be involved in the death of... No, please don't say that. It's, it's not possible. I know the boy, and I don't... Father, anything is possible in these dark times. Anything. That boy didn't even come to say goodbye to Julia. Didn't they love each other dearly? He must be terribly scared, and Julia always used to say that. Yeah, sure, she used to say they were just friends, but... You know too, right? Friends are not supposed to do such things, Father. Or are they? But anyway, you're defending them both. You, my husband, and even the nanny who, deep down, is a good woman. The nanny? I believe the nanny is the one who hurt Julia. With her evil passion for those cards, they are cursed things. I hope you made them disappear. Of course. I keep them safe in my room. Anyway, you must forgive me, Father. I have to go. They've come to pick me up. Have a good day. You too. Lapo's involved in Martha's death. No, he might when not Martha be. Martha was losing her mind again. How could anyone oh, even see. imagine such nonsense? And Don Attilio, he is a great friend, but what a weird view. Those cards are just a game, but most importantly, they're mine. Why on earth did they take them from me? Because they're bad. Uh, no, not quite, Blair. That was the bidet. bidet. That's the toilet. The bidet is used for cleaning ass, you know, stuff like that. I've used a bidet once in my life, and I didn't know how it worked. But you're supposed to wet, you're supposed to wet a towel, wipe your ass in it. There's like a special ass wiping towel. Some of them spray your ass directly. 
Some toilets are so advanced, they wash your ass, dry it, sing you a song. I'm not even kidding. There are toilets that sing you a song while you're shitting. They shit, they warm the seat for you, they wash your ass, they powder your ass, they give you like a, like a, you know, like a breath of air and to dry your ass off. And then they spritz you with some good smelling scents so your ass don't stink. I'm not joking. They make these things exist. Okay. And quite frankly, that is a man's dream. You know, that's the kind of toilet I one day want to have. Fuck, like, you know, you know, mansions and, you know, Rolexes. Fuck that shit. I want a bidet that will, like, fucking wash my ass for me. Like, everything. I don't want to have to do that anymore. You know, I deserve it. I, de <laughs> I deserve it, okay? I don't want to hear it. Following the dramatic news from the countryside, Archbishop Toccarelli will protest Toccarelli. the French in the city. 25 ISO film. When the sun is high in the sky, it's perfect. All right, new film, so for an overexposed sun. Oh, I didn't need to look at this, sorry. General Edith K. New rules on curfew and women's behavior. Of course. German command of S. Vincenzo Atori. Telephone number 1185. Judges. So they can write down those. The patrols of German armed forces. The radio needs to be kept on at all times these days. The it can save your life knowing things on time, especially before painting. they happen. But now that now that they're not sleeping, we can go snoop around. Yes, Tenzel, I did. I already answered you before. I completed it yesterday. What's that say? Dear Mother, this is hard, but I have something to tell you. I found out that Julia is pregnant. Go to the lake tomorrow morning at 7 and watch her as she bathes. You will see that her tummy is growing. Martha. What? I'm not pregnant. Why is everything becoming even more confusing? I'm searching for an explanation, but instead I'm left with more questions. So, who the fuck was... It makes sense, because Martha wasn't seeing anybody. Julia has that Lupo or Lopo guy, or whatever his name is. You know what I mean? It's possible... That she's... I'm fucking confused. Are we pregnant? Maybe we miss... Well, the, the, Here miss I don't know! Nanny and I always used to play with them. She would predict my future, and I pretended to predict hers. The future was always good for everyone. I gotta look at my objectives. I think my objectives was, get, was to get these tarot. She saw my true future, which she hid from me. Or more likely, these cards are actually just a stupid game to reassure and deceive oneself with. But deceiving oneself is sometimes necessary. How can we live happily otherwise? What's up, Rodrigo? It's a lot of information. Romola. 15th of July, 1944. Dear Mrs. Erene, I'm writing to let you know that all is well here at the villa. Thank you for being so considerate and caring. I apologize for the simplicity of the housing you were forced to live in. I also locked the room where the little one used to stay as requested. I've left you the key. It is the one with the pink key ring. Try to stay safe. Best regards, Nanny. Why on earth did Mummy have that door locked? It was my room. What is she trying to hide? Okay, I'm trying to see. Wait, how do you... Is it map? Oh, yeah, objectives. All right, so happy room. Why have they locked my child? So we got to find the key for that. That's probably the finale. Or, you know what I mean. Camera at the lake. De oh, we got... I forgot about developing the film. We never got to do that yet. Newspaper. Read the newspaper dated for today. So that's why there's still objectives. So we can probably keep up on current... It's probably going to get way more nutty as we go on. Perverton again. I feel like these pills do nothing other than agitate her. This is Mummy's jewelry. She wears them every day. Even though Daddy says ah, it's good impractical thought, Annie. and dangerous to show signs of wealth these days. And As maybe usual, she doesn't want to listen to reason and ends up arguing with Daddy until he goes to play war, as she says. And maybe, um Annie 
Or sorry, um... The keys to my old room are not here. Where are they? Sorry, but maybe maybe mom went out and was like, man, fuck Dad this bitch. Dad loves these prints of Florence. She got pregnant? I find them a bit Wu-Tang. And, 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 I don't know, man. There's too, much, there's too many questions still. Okay, I obviously have to still go read some stuff. Maybe Martha was jealous of Julia. The superior commander of the German Federal Armed Forces announces, one, whoever is in possession of weapons or explosives not reported to the German headquarters will be shot. Two, That's nice. Whoever harbors bandits and or protects them and provides them with clothing and or weapons will be shot. Three, Whoever is aware of the existence of any rebel groups or even lone rebels without reporting them will be shot. I love how, bl like, I love how bland, not bland, like, they were literally. workers in Germany. The following rules are in place. They will, you will be shot and killed. You will Germany. die. A commitment of a maximum period of one year before returning to Italy. The superior commander of the German Federal Armed Forces announces, one, whoever is in possession of weapons or explosives not reported to the German headquarters will be shot. <laughs> oh, Two, I already read this, sorry. <laughs> right, will be fighting shot. Fighting in Normandy. Victorious Germanic <laughs> counterattack <laughs> on the road from Perriers to Carentan. Upon Heber reconquered north of saint Lo. Many US losses caused by the flying bomb action. You know what this should say? You pour milk before you pour the cereal. You will be shot. You put your pants on, right? Okay, your pants are on. You put your socks on, then shoe, then sock, then shoe. You will be shot. Socks on both feet first, you sick son of a bitch. There are people who do that. You know what I mean? What else? <laughs> what else will you do? Will you be shot? You know what I mean? <laughs> this psychopathic shit, you know? Oh, man. War rages on the Eastern Front, an attack launched by the Soviets after hours of cannonade. The fight on this front has been going on for a long time. Truth. <laughs> you get your shots, you will be shot. <laughs> Technically, you got shot. If you pour your milk first, Chris, in Nazi Germany, I'm afraid you wouldn't be here today. <laughs> We'd be like, where did Chris go? All right, we still got to develop. Doesn't make any sense. Fucking lying bitch. Anyway, we read it. I wonder how many days pass. We got to develop naturally. I think we got it. Let's go in the basement. Actually, no, let's go check on Julie. Uh, sorry, let's check on Martha. Martha, dear, how are you? You haven't aged a day. Jesus, that's dark, Dano. That is some dark shit. Okay, well, let's go down. Follow me down to the basement. Develop some photos. They still haven't cleaned up that wine, which gives me AIDS. Ooh. I'll check it out. What does IR mean? Oh, the tarot cards. Oh, we'll check those in a minute. I'll take the photo first. Ah, fuck it. We'll shuffle. Divination. Oh my god. We're about to- we're about to find my- okay. God. The hermit. What does that mean? What does that mean? The, oh, temperance. Stars. 
The solution is still far away. I must be patient and wise. But luck is not on my side, unfortunately. Only one divination per day. So that's going to tell me what's... Okay. Oh, uh, infrared. Good call, Gareth. Good call. All right, let's infrared. So something that we can't see that f the, f the film can. So when I took the photo of my sister, I used the... I, well, I don't think I used the infrared. Required add-ons, the tripod. Wait, why do I need the tripod? The subject is framed. What does that mean? Is there somebody there? Bro, you better not be fucking with me right now. Okay, I'm gonna need which one? Sorry, this and that. It's too dark, so we need a flash. And we need to focus. Let's see. In focus. Okay. I'm scared. I am very scared. Okay. There's something there. Tell you what, let's let's just go develop. I, I the curiosity is gonna get to me on that one, guys. Oh wait, what do we have on the table? There's more shit. tape recorder how many lenses do we have now with this lens everything gets bigger 95 percent of men <laughs> would be using that <laughs> this lens increases the framed area it allows me to fit more into the image red filter for super high contrast photos i would never need that lens <laughs> never i mean if that happened People would start to die. You know, you walk near me, you just get knocked the fuck out, you know? I have to be careful and keep the volume down as I listen. I must go unnoticed. I am meant to be deaf after all. Ready? At least she thinks of that. Julia, you ready? Sure, Daddy. I'm good to start. I've already started recording. Oh, no, my voice will sound awful. No way, come on. Didn't you want to study singing anyway? No, no, no. I was young and stupid when I said that. Okay. Ready. Go. Oh, how nice. Music disabled stream remote. For last week's concert. Well, thanks for telling me what the copyright shit is. The recording. But I was right. My voice is awful. It cannot be called singing. Anyway, it's time I develop these film roles. I can't wait any longer. I wish I could just stop time. Wouldn't it be funny if it was just like... S S S S S S S S S S That bitch being dummy thick bitch being dummy thick But it's all like crackly like you're on an old player I stay live all this purple in my cup match some great fives I'm so fly, I'm getting head like a blow dry. <laughs> like, These just all that. Change everything. <laughs> this would be so fucking I funny. I bear the fact that I may have hurt Like Martha. a filter on that. I would rather die. What's up, Caleb? my head in these memory lapses. I'm scared Such about that optional memory. photo. What are we going to see there? It's like getting lost inside yourself. Oh, my. Whoa, that's actually a really cool photo. Okay, let's develop this one because it's one. I think you get achievements for developing these. Oh shit, no, god damn it. I cut off the lantern. Whatever, it looks fine. Is 
See, I didn't mean to cut off the lantern like that. But honestly, that makes that might make that might have made it better. Okay. Next photo. I have to develop whatever the hell I had in that frame. I want to see that. I am so curious about this, guys. Something is there. It doesn't look like anything's there, but there's something there. Dude, if, if a ghost pops up, I'm going to shit my ass apart. I'm just saying. Oh, there's letters. He who flees from the light what is this? hides joke? behind it. Maybe someone wrote on the film? Also, what does that even mean? Light, like divine light? Something to do with religion, maybe? That's kind of... We'll, we'll hold on to that, just in case we need it. So it's a hidden note. Okay, now, do we just have to pick which one we develop? That's her running out to save her, right? I mean, naturally, you know which one they want you to fo that want you to do is this one. Obviously. I'm carrying Martha to shore. I'm trying to save her. My memories, although fuzzy, do match reality. I feel a little better. Now I can find out who really hurt Martha. Maybe I should meet with the white lady. She might be able to tell me something. Is this crazy talk? Yes, definitely. 100% it is. What's normal about any of this? Maybe you have to be a little crazy to get anything done. Truth. Okay, now what's our next objective? Sorry, uh, is it O? How do you, is it C? I should, there should be a shortcut to do that. All right, the white lady. Go to the lake. My happy room. Find the keys. A strange note. So these things we don't know. So let's go outside and, I mean, we'll go to the lake. I don't know if, like, those things are optional objectives or not. This is the center of our farm. But since we moved here, it hasn't worked like it used to. Oh, Security I see. Remember that? Okay, I see where we are now. So they want me to go to the lake. This is a pretty big map. I don't know if it's all interactable, but it looks like this whole lake area is. I still got to find the keys. Nanny does not say where she left the keys. They had a pink key ring attached to them. They are not on the key, some key rack. Someone has taken them. So should we head there? I think it's you can't leave the streets. And the general of the SS gets a little bit more und privileges. Alright, we'll follow this route. At least it's not like it's still kinda dark in these woods though, isn't it? All up in that ass, 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 earth, earth, earth. It's a German army helmet. I feel like I'm not where I need to be.
mean, that's probably good enough. Shit, I didn't mean to move it. German soldiers. Daddy ordered patrols to be carried out near the house, but how could they have lost a helmet? God only knows. The white lady. What the fuck? just doing it's dangerous i know but i want to follow them and see what's happening remember that dead end i was talking about earlier oh my goodness Holy shit, he got fucked up. He must have hit a mine or something. Oh god, please no. Oh, it's Lapo. Lapo, my dear friend. What have they done to you? Your handkerchief was the symbol of what you believed in. At least that is left of you. And it's also red, that thing with the knife on it by the woods. You think that has something to do with it? They didn't confirm the kill or anything? I mean, he's dead. We know he is, but... Dear Julia, are you surprised that I've addressed this to you and don't think you're dead? Everyone calls you Martha now, right? He knows. I know you too well. Ow. I can never understand why no one else can ever tell you apart. Not even your own mother and father. Right, Martha that's what I said. Is gone, and I cannot reconcile myself. She did not just get shot. Okay, she just got shot. Okay, now Julia and Martha are really dead. Du hast ein Mädchen erschossen, du Idiot. Scheiße, scheiße, scheiße. Was machen wir jetzt? Sieh mal, was sie um ihren Hals hat. Sie ist eine von ihnen. Es musste getan werden. Sie ist die Tochter von General Erich K., du verdammter Trottel. Sie war die Freundin von diesem armen Kerl. Oh, verdammt, jetzt sind wir wirklich am Arsch. Scheiße, lass uns abhauen. Aber, aber sie lebt noch. Sie liegt im Sterben. Siehst du, wo du sie getroffen hast? Sie ist bestimmt schon tot. Wir müssen jetzt abhauen, sonst sind wir auch bald tot. She's not dead. They could have helped her, but they're cowards. I'm dying, I thought. But strangely enough, I wasn't afraid. In fact, I was almost relieved. When I returned, I found myself once again in the midst of a bad dream. One whose meaning I did not understand at the time. Mother. Uh, no, that's not it. It's not about mother, I guess. Martha, I give you back your destiny. It's gotta be destiny. Uh, it's not? Your appearance just seems kind of bland to me. Just in my opinion. So she's not dead, is she for real? Huh? 
We didn't get a chance to finish reading the letter. That yeah, we don't know. Now I see with mine eyes. Nice first try. It's it's pretty literal. and turns here two sisters were destined to die julia the first sister and martha the second on julia's day of departing identical twins stood before me impossible to tell apart they questioned my presence since they were still so young julia must come with me i demanded but they both claimed to be Martha. I explained that Martha's fate was soon to be the same, and their games were useless. I didn't have time for it. The war was keeping me busy. But they didn't concede, and instead kept insisting. Can we follow you together? No, impossible. Are you sure Martha will die too? Nothing is certain in wartime. What if the wrong person went with you? Then you would have cheated death. One would die unjustly, and the other would simply be delaying her fate. They discussed amongst themselves, then hugged before one of them came forward. She stared in a determined, almost threatening manner. I guessed it was Martha sacrificing herself, giving more time to her sister. But I stayed silent, not to reveal their failed deception. No one lies to the face of their own death. So I asked how their choice was reached. We do lots by throwing a medallion, she said quietly. They had trusted in fate. Oh, how naive they were. They knew fate plays by its own rules, which is true, but it is also my ally. Fate never would have allowed the wrong girl to follow me. In that case, my work was done. She must have been Julia. However, little to my knowledge at the time, that blasted medallion had the same name engraved on both sides. Martha's. So, my first assumption was correct. They were too damn smart and had fooled both fate and me. Got him. One thing is for sure. I'll put things back where they belong. I will correct my ignorance and give fate back its blindfold. So it's still very confusing. He's kind of speaking in riddles, but... I mean, it looks like... We were... I don't know what that means, though. Like, what, you know what I mean? Like, are they conspiring? Like, I don't know. There's, like, seems like a subplot here. That's actually the main plot. So what we're following isn't accurate. Damn, she looks more pregnant. So Have you seen that? She looks a little more belly bumpy. I can hardly breathe. To me. Okay, um, before we continue, I do have to go to the bathroom really quick. Sorry, guys. That coffee went through me. I'll be right back.
Alright, sorry about that, fam. Okay, so, let's resume. So if I had worn, uh, so if I had worn, do you think, based on that statement, do you think if I had worn, um, my own clothes, do you think it would have worked? Or maybe Even I did the right thing. scary fairy tales. I just went to the bathroom gaming. That's all. Okay, do I have to get... Yeah. It seems like I keep getting injured. Like, I have bandages on me, you know? It's the 20th today, so that's going to change things up. No, no, no. My bag is not here. My diary. Lapo's letter. So if I, if I wear How this... How is my daughter? Please, Doctor. Please give me good news. It's a miracle she's alive, Eric. But she will be all right. Yeah, I feel like the... I'm wondering if the reason I, I managed to end it that way is because I, I dressed as Martha first, then Julia second. Do you think that might have been a double dip? Oh, maybe we should listen in. The bullet passed right by her heart and exited her chest. Unbelievably, it missed her lungs, spine, and heart. She could have been paralyzed or died. But thankfully, she's fine. I examined her thoroughly. She didn't even lose that much blood. She was lucky. And you were lucky, so to speak. She was lucky that my wife went for a walk in the woods. Otherwise... Otherwise she would have bled to death, yes. I don't know what to say. All of this. It's too much. So much death and suffering. Nothing more. Don't worry, Eric. She's young, so she'll recover quickly. I'll be here all day anyway. Thank you, Doctor. For everything. Hey. Do you mind coming with me to pick my wife up from the cemetery? The funeral will start soon in the chapel. Of course not. Lead the way. But it sounds like it doesn't matter what's going to happen. They're both it's supposed to die. These preparations for the funeral. Irina wants everything to be perfect. It's her way of coping, so she doesn't have to think about. Everything that's true. Everything. We did give back her appearance. So maybe that's what, yeah, that's what they're thinking. One thing could really change. Maybe too much. Can I please get dressed? Is that possible? The ceremony is today. Oh. So I need a suitable dress. I would like to spend a moment with my sister, just me and her. I just want to see if her before people arrive for the funeral and then her dress take shirt her looks away. the same. A final farewell. So we're actually burying her this time. Well, let's look at our objectives again. I don't know why it does that. You have to hit map and then go to objectives. So I have to read the newspaper for today. I still haven't found the keys. Find Lapo's letter, find the bag. So that's a major thing. Final farewell, say goodbye. So that's the main mission. I still want to find the happy room. There must be something around here that we can use. It might unlock Julia's lock, or sorry, Martha's lockbox as well. There might be like, we might find something, you know? There's my bag. Thank God. I want to finish reading that letter. I've got to know. Let's hope Lapo's letter is in there. Dear Julia, are you surprised that I've addressed this to you and don't think you're dead? Everyone calls you Martha now, right? I know you too well. I can never understand why no one else can ever tell you apart. Not even your own mother and father. Martha is gone, and I cannot reconcile myself to that fact. I have to stay hidden, and sadly I can't run to you. 
even if I would love nothing more than to hold you tight and cry together. No words. I just want to be close to you. Can we meet in the barn tonight? I will try my best to be there around midnight. Don't be alarmed, but if things get ugly, please remember this number. 6934. I'm gonna write that down. He knew he was in serious danger, but what about Six. the letter? I had it in my hand when the soldiers okay. ran off. Mummy found me, and if she's read it, well, she hates Lapo, and now she must know who I am. No, no, she probably would have left me there to die. She'd rather have no daughter than the wrong one. Before I passed out, I must have put it back in my bag. There is no other explanation. I don't know. Something is. Something else is happening. It's happening. Map. Sorry. Oh, it, it remembers it for me. Use the number. Please remember this number. Is it a phone number or a combination? So I didn't have to write that down. Okay, well, let's keep looking. Let's look around and see what we can find. If we open up the map, is there any objectives marked? Not currently. I'll bet at some point we're going to go that to that. That's that's my guess. Violence against citizens continues in La Romola. And once again, General K's family has come under fire. Now it is the life of her sister, Martha, that is in danger. The blow when it's not too sunny outside, the 200 ISO film works well. So dark. God that the girl is alive. The anti-fascist political motive appears to be the only reason... General Edith K. New rules on curfew and women's behavior. German command of S. Vincenzo Atori. Telephone number 1185. On the writing in the photo. What did the photo writing say? He who flees from the light hides behind it. Could be. Who, he who flees from the light. She leaves them everywhere. I think she's having too many and Who too flees often. from the light? Hides behind it. So maybe literally, like, is it literal? Like something is behind a lamp or something? There are more and more weapons around. And everyone is scared after what happened. Oh, there's new tarot's right. We'll get a new. Let's get a new divination for today. Mm. Empress. Seems nice. The high priestess. to see beyond appearances there are those who betray me and speak ill of me but someone will know how to give me the right advice okay I mean, I'd like to go in there. But why would Julia just have a room? That doesn't make sense. Why would, if they were twins, you know, something seems off to me. Something's not right. Attempted murder in La Romola. After the murder of Julia Kay, today her twin sister is the victim of another attempted murder. The condition of the young girl found by the German troops is no cause for concern. The political motive behind this is becoming all the more clear. But that's not what happened. Survive. It's all wrong. Mummy was the one who found me. The German soldiers shot me. I'm best to stay quiet. No one ever believes the truth. Well, why would they say the German soldiers killed you or hit, shot New you? That wouldn't make sense. ban on the use of bicycles. Over the last few days, cyclists have once again shot at members of the Italian armed forces and at civilians in the streets. The offenders will be punished in accordance with German martial law. Even in Florence, the war is beginning to be felt. 
Supplies are starting to run out. Bread may only last a few more days. Prices are rising dramatically. Meat can now be found for 100 to 140 lira per kilo. The gas has been cut and there is no coal. The Battle of Tuscany. German operations in the Livorno area. Extremely violent fighting in the streets of the city. Okay. Well, I'd like to go back to the basement. I should pick up the phone but remain silent. If I let the caller speak first, I'll find out who it is. Hello? Ma'am? Can you hear me? Is there somebody there? Mr. Eric? Oh, it's the nanny. I can confide in her. Nanny? Hello, it's me. What? Hello? Oh my lord. I must be dreaming or something. No, Nanny, you're not dreaming. It's really me, it's Julia. Oh my god. Julia, my little sparrow. How wonderful. Sorry, but I thought you were dead. I... I saw you lying there dead. This brings me so much joy that... Actually, you must explain to me, my little sparrow, what is happening? I told Nanny everything that had happened. She was sad for Martha, of course, but very happy at the same time. I was the one she had a special bond with. I explained to her that I wanted to try and meet the White Lady, even if I knew it was a silly idea. But she didn't think I was a fool. Quite the opposite. She explained to me what I should do in an attempt to meet her. It was complicated. I noted everything down carefully in my diary. Who knows, maybe she did it only to keep me occupied, while deciding what to do with me and who to warn. I won't ever know, though, because that very same day, a bomb struck the villa and she died. They all died. We should have been what? in that house ourselves, but instead, poor Nanny. They just kill people off right, left, right, and center. Bye, Nanny. I love you. Goodbye, my darling. I thought I'd lost you. Be careful, my little sparrow. Well, shit. Hey, at least the table's back. Martha was taken to the chapel for her funeral. I can make phone I calls. I say goodbye to her alone before everyone arrives. Asylum? wonder how many phone calls I can actually make. Am I allowed to just make an unlimited amount of phone calls? Okay, I know I can make phone calls. I'll come back later, but I want to go find, like, that riddle. This fabric is not new to me, yet I do not think I've ever seen it in the house. Hmm. Did I have new photos? Okay, well, read the diary. If something goes wrong, well, he got shot, so. How come this doesn't have anything on it? Like, see, this was an optional one, and I took the photo, but it didn't give me a, a thing about it, which is interesting. Maybe someone wrote on the film. Also, what does that even mean? Light, like divine light? Something to do with religion, maybe? So, maybe I should look for a cross. Maybe a cross. Or it's literal light. There's a cross there. I mean, there could be a cross over every fucking doorway, though. You know? Do I have any photos that need... I don't think I have any photos that need... Uh, 
developing. I think we're Gucci. These masks, I remember them vividly. I always try to escape their gaze. Naturally. War. Always war. War Even never changes. Paintings. I really want to find those keys. I don't want I don't know if I like I have to do it at a certain time of day like Hmm. Maybe it's another time. She's making more progress with the painting, yes. Paints for like a couple minutes and she's done. Yeah, I don't know. I was looking for like a... I mean, she said divine light, but I don't think that's what it means necessarily. There is something to do with that for sure. Because I'll bet there's like a lot of answers in there. Is there a cross anywhere else? I've only found one cross. So far. I mean... Six, nine, three, four. So that's probably the main mission, I would assume. Read the diary. Oh, I missed, forgot about the diary. July 19th. I retrieved the cameras at the lake, but I had convinced myself that I was the one who had hurt Martha. So much so that when I had the rolls with me on the way home, I found myself in another horrible dream. I don't even remember going to sleep. As soon as I woke up, I developed the film. The photos confirmed to me that my memory of that night was correct. It was a great relief. I have decided to go back to the lake in an attempt to communicate with the white lady. I know it's a crazy thought, but I can't get it out of my head. I need to know what happened to Martha, so I must pursue every possible avenue, even the path of insanity. Two more unread pages. So. Now I know what must be done to meet the lady. Nanny has explained everything to me. I must try to meet her early in the morning when it is foggy, or all will have been in vain. That's what the legend says. This is what I need to do. One, I must reinvoke her loss by putting her into contact with her lover. To do this, Nanny said to look for his grave. I know where that is. But there are so many. Daddy always said that infrared photos can see what the naked eye cannot. Maybe then they also see ghosts. There wouldn't be anything about that now. Considering I'm trying to contact one after all. How crazy. Two. A part of me needs to enter her world. A lock of hair would work. So I'll need scissors I to have cut some. some off. Three. I will need an object that connects her world to mine. I don't know what to do for this yet. Hopefully something will come to mind when I least expect it. Four. To communicate with her, I will need to use my tarot cards. I will meet with the lady on the island where her lover was executed. Did I not say about that island? Obviously. Okay. Alright, well. Fireplace, hey? That's worth a check. I mean, there's a fireplace here. Nothing is really hidden, though, so you'll be able to see something if you go up to it. I'll try this fireplace. I'll make phone calls, too. Mummy and Daddy. They are the epitome of wealth and elegance. But pain pays no heed to money and style. The only way people could tell Martha and me apart was by dressing... Oh, they said the same things. I wasn't sure if it was the same shit. Okay, let's make some phone calls, then. Should 
Should we just go on the list? for the officers of San Casciano. How can I help? Hi, I was hoping to hear whether there has been any development on the investigation into the murder of Julia Kay. Wait a moment, please. Who's calling? I am Renee Kay, Julia Kay's mother. Mrs Kay, forgive me. I didn't recognise your voice. Unfortunately, I don't have any real news. We are following up on some suspects. We assume we're with the boy who was killed in the woods outside your house. They seem to be planning something else. But your husband is probably the best person to ask about that. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye, madam. We'll call the next one. 6593. Maybe. Not now. Is there anybody else you could talk to? Don Atilio? 6938. nothing to say to Don Atilio at the moment before speaking with him I well what's my hold on what's my must be foggy okay um 6934 we can try that to few things straight I don't know if I should just keep calling, like, the numbers on here or what. What am I at? 0782. Why would I call the asylum? Mummy was there a few years ago now, and I wouldn't know what to ask. To be honest, I don't understand why the number is still here. You never know. What am I going to ask at the town hall? I don't know. Why don't you tell me this shit before I even dial the fucking number? How about that? So far, there's been only one number I need to phone. See, it's a good thing when I talked to the Carabinieri that I didn't say that I was Martha because she can't speak. So... Oh. Hello, Maria speaking. How may I help? Shit. Um. Hello, Maria. It's Anna L., a close friend of Irene K. Oh, yes. Irene spoke about you. How can I help? Irene is making a dress for me, so I wanted to know whether she bought that beautiful and vibrant red and black fabric. I assume so. I am sorry, madam, but I cannot give you that kind of information. Irene is a loyal customer, you see. I understand perfectly, Maria. I'm only asking as I wanted to order a few meters of it for myself, without Irene feeling that she needs to sacrifice hers for me. I'm sorry, Miss Anna, but unfortunately, we do not have any more of that fabric. We got more on order for Irene. I'm sorry. I mean, we got a bit of information out of that. Yeah, I know. Thank you. 
Let's try calling German command. For no reason. <laughs> Pull all troops back. Pull them all back. <laughs> I have no reason to call daddy's command. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's call the, uh, let's call the number. 6934. Oh, right. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, she's deaf. But she wouldn't be speaking. She wouldn't speak. That's the thing. She So, like, people know her that she doesn't speak. You know what I mean? You've called this number. Must be dead then. Rest in peace, fair comrade. Yes, Lapo is dead. I am due. No, no, don't talk. We don't need to know who you are. By calling this number, it means Lapo wanted you to complete his work. A telephone cable near the house of German General Erich K has to be cut. One goes to the house, but there's another cable we suspect is connected to a secret base. That is the one that has to be cut. If you see any German vehicles around, let us know immediately. We won't use this number anymore. It's dangerous. Use a telegraph. That will be safer. I hope you know how to use them. Otherwise, you'll have to come up with something. This is important. Frequency X. Before the message, telegraph town on fire to identify yourself. Long live the homeland. Long live the liberation. Should I sabotage the cable and become a spy? I don't know. My father is German. It would be like betraying him even though he himself hates this war. But what happened to Lapo and those guys? If I can save someone's life, maybe I should try. Or maybe I can talk to Daddy about it. He may be able to advise me on what to do. I don't even know the first thing about all this. What were you thinking, Lapo? To cut the cable, I will need sharp scissors. I have those already. Taylor scissors should be fine. Okay, well, we just unlocked a new ability or a new mission i know where that bunker is i've already stumbled upon it it's like right here so find the telephone pole wonder where she is oh right wait hold on a second stop stop no not settings Um, so these are the important numbers they'll need to phone later. I see. Okay. So let's go find that telephone cable. At least it's daytime. And we, we can say goodbye to our sister, too. You know, that's over here. Let's go to the little mini chapel thing or whatever the hell this is. I'm not 100% sure what it is. Let me guess, that's a photo. Okay, it's long enough. I fucking get Poor it. Little one. Holy He's dead. shit. Poor little guy. His place is by Martha's side. That's symbolism, is it not? Isn't that the photo? Isn't that the sparrow we took a picture of? Nanny it always calls me Little Sparrow. Yeah. This is the part of me that died with Martha. It'll be safe next to her. So you actually have a chapel here. I've got to put the bird down. Here, Martha, this is my heart. Carry it with you. I'm starting to understand how painful your condition must have been. Not being hey, able to properly communicate with anyone is becoming increasingly difficult. I envied you, but I did not see your suffering. You I could did not sign understand it. Understand your courage. 
I miss you so much, Martha. I'm not worthy to dress in your clothes. Well, we're not dressing in her clothes. Commune of San Casciano. Province of Florence. Death certificate. From the Register of Death Certificates of this Commune, number 174, part 3. Series 12 of the year 1944. Ah, oh, could be. It is certified that on the day of the 16th of July of the year 1944, Julia Kay has died. Resident of Via Perchabaya, born in La Romola. On the 26th of February 1923, the daughter of General Erich K. and Irene K. Don Attilio D. will give the funeral and the esteemed Mr. Alberto M., who will look after the burial in the cemetery of La Romola. Telephone number 6537. The official state civil service. General Galeazzo T. That raven is making a big fuss. There's only a few signatures for my funeral. If people had known that it was actually Martha, there would have been far more. I'm sorry that I took this from you too. That's some shit. I don't see anything I can interact with. Like, I don't want to miss anything. I obviously want to get Maybe in that. Maybe it's the same raven that killed that poor sparrow. 100% it is. Am I supposed to follow it? Hi, Mr. Raven. There's a telephone pole. We don't know if that's the right one. Wait, this is like, we're not even on the map. This is like off the beaten track, isn't it? There's the fabric again. Dress? It's made from the same fabric I found a shred of next to the lake. In fact, it is torn. It must be my mother's. My goodness. Dude, you're not going to end it there. There's there's objectives I need to do. I started to suspect that Mummy could have been involved in Martha's murder. Lost in these thoughts, hours passed, and I completely forgot about the funeral. When I realized it was evening, they were already carrying the coffin towards the cemetery. She never loved me. I knew that well. But I would never have believed that. Had it been her, I struggled to believe it but it made so much sense. At the lake, she must have thought Martha was me because she was convinced that I was dead. Hmm. Like how many, can, do you run out of time? That's my concern is I don't want to run out of time. When the funeral ended, I felt an irresistible urge to play. I loved music. I started playing without thinking about the possible consequences. I didn't care anymore. I needed to feel alive, to exist again. Okay, obviously we can't even hear this. What's going on here? Julia? Is that you? No, it's not possible. Martha's never played. She's deaf, yet... No. This is madness. My God. So, Martha? I understand now. You can get all of the attention, right? You were jealous. 
weren't you? Because she was a wonderful girl and, and you're just a useless little slut. How did you manage to convince her? I get it now. But she... she talked to me. I... I... no. It doesn't make sense. I will have you locked up in an asylum. You hear? That's enough! You will pay for what you've done, you cursed lunatic! They will torture you to reveal the monsters in your head. Whoops. I didn't tell her to play that piano. I never once said, yo, dog, you should probably play it. Her words were as sharp as blades. I tried to tell her that it wasn't me. I showed her the photos I developed that proved my innocence. But she grew all the more angry, calling me crazy. And but she said she talked to she me. She began to hit me with everything she had at hand. I closed my eyes as that might put her at the scene. began to take over in me. Memories came flooding back. Not memories of actual past events, but more so of feelings. Feelings I had when I was little. They were scary. They were the fears of a little girl. Despite what had happened, I went walking in the woods early the next morning to meet the lady. No, we're not, the we're not done before, yet. My father had tried desperately to console me. Mom's just crazy. She's not Talk actually going to make me, a lockdown. You know I love you. I just want to understand what happened. I am happy you are alive. Even if we have lost Martha, your mother was just in shock. She didn't want to hurt you. I think she did there, bruv. Can I, can I go back to the house? I'm sure I will at some point. That's not a good one. I'm going to make it. It will all change eventually. But luck will not be my ally and everything will be very difficult. It's not the first time they said everything would be very difficult and luck would not be my ally. Hold on. Take a photo of the grave in the woods. So that's where it is. I, I, oh, here's what I'm going to do, actually. I'm actually going to go here. So I'm going to... Yeah, so I'm going to walk forward, take a left. Let me just confirm the route. There's actually something back here. Hold on. Oh, no, it's a dead end. Just kidding. All right, I'm going to actually go past it. I'm going to try and find a telephone pole and see where it goes. Because that's obviously where we need to be. That's the photo, so. I mean, it's foggy. But I'm right now going to do... I think that I think some of them are main, some of them are optionals, and they could affect the how the game ends. That's my guess. Okay, this looks right. I don't actually see a telephone pole. Unless we can't do anything about it. What is this place? This never used to be here. We've already been here, girl. What are you talking about? Thing is, I don't actually see a telephone pole. Hey, Dark. I don't want to cut the wrong cord and then all of a sudden there's no line in the house. You know what I mean? What's that? Oh, personal object. All right, let's go to the lover. I mean, finding more about the lady is probably the main objective here, but... Yeah, so I've already been here. Infrared I camera. I don't know what I'm hoping to find, but what else can I do? 
I will hopefully see if one of these graves is hiding something. I hope that the infrared film will show me. Okay, out of focus. Okay. We need this and this. And we're ready. So it'll probably say a word of some sort. Okay. Develop the photo. Hold on. Should I... Should I go get the personal object? I might as well, and then develop. I mean, it's nice that you're not necessarily bound to one spot. Hey, Lauren. Wait, what? Oh, do you mean do you mean COVID? <laughs> I was gonna say, if you still if you actually got the chicken pox, that'd be hilarious. I mean it wouldn't be, but like chicken pox have died out. I remember getting them when I was like five or something. But you're, you're it's better to get them early. And then yeah. I mean, still, at the end of the day, the consensus is mother is a bitch. Th Wait, that's where we actually have to go, right? I'm sure something will reveal. The communication cable. Wait, you actually have the chicken pox for real? I didn't think it was even a thing anymore. I thought it like was it like an extinct virus. All right, it's somewhere here. Oh, wait a minute. I just realized something. I might. I think that'll take me to the island. Oh, I don't want. Oh, what's that? Ah, that's it. Okay, this is the item. My dress. It could be the element that links my world with that of the lady. Well, I've gonna... been here for a few days in a place that is both mine and hers. So good thing I didn't go in the boat. That would have brought me to there. So I'm actually going to head back now before I go deal with the lady. I mean, obviously, this is what I have to do it today because it's foggy. So I have to try this. So I should have honestly waited a minute. I should have gone back to the house before going all the way there and all the way back. But I wanted to be sure. I Okay, well, that that's crazy to me, Lauren. What, what's it like? Honestly, as an adult, because like I said, I haven't had it since I, I was a child. Like I was like five or something. I don't even remember how old I was. I remember I was in elementary school, though maybe six, six years old, like 97, I think that would have been at six. That's wild. I hear it's worse in adults, though. I know like it's it's as a kid. Yeah, it's unpleasant. You get a fever, you know, you get the the actual chicken pox themselves. Very itchy. You're not supposed to scratch them. Um, I had an ex who, um, she had, when she had chicken pox, she scratched one off and it left like a permanent scar on the side of her head. It was like, it, you can't really see it, but it, you know, it's just, just saying, you know.
I mean, I did see that telephone pole, guys, but I didn't. I don't want to cut the anything actually, because I'm not seeing shit. I'm not seeing. So I'm wondering if they do that, and you end up finding it later. And just because you can cut it, doesn't mean you should. You know. I have to develop that photo. Is there anything else while I'm here that I could do? I can go back outside. I think that's the room and that I have not, I don't know anything about that right now. So there's nothing I can do. I will develop the photo. I thought I was supposed to be getting achievements for developing photos, but maybe it's just certain achievements you get. Uh, oh, you fuck. I'm here. Let's develop. The green filter. Useful for landscapes. The yellow filter. If it were to snow, it would be perfect. Alright, let's see what's on this bish. Whoa. That's creepy. Don't ruin the photo, otherwise you gotta go back and take another one. It's a guy. the grave I've been searching for, in the spirit of a prisoner. Just like the white lady, he's trapped in this world, but they can no longer meet one another. Evil is separating them. Crazy. I mean, it's not, a, it's not spooky. I mean, it is, but it's not, like, scary, you know? Well, I'm glad we checked that out. We're going to need to. Wait, what's this about? Why is it still telling me to find the correct grave? Oh, I see. It's the one on the right. I see. So we had to go. Okay, okay, okay. Gotcha. So we had to figure out which one was his. That way we can interact with it. So now we know the right grave is the one. Well, the correct grave is the one on the far right. Now, again, before we go back to the lover, we're going to go... Try and go up to the backyard. It is connected by this, I think. I don't know if all this stuff is like like all the missions are doable or if some of them you can you can't do, you know. Oh my goodness. Oh no, the fence has been destroyed. What the hell happened? Why are the animals hurt? What happened to these things? Dude, all the animals are f are fucking dead. Nazi fascists at the Nazi stake. Nazi fascists at the stake. What? Who could have done this? What did these poor creatures have to do with anything? That's a little unnecessary. It looks like it was slaughtered with a knife. Is someone threatening us? I'm just looking at the telephone wires. I just want to see where this goes. Because if it goes into the house, this is the... Not the one to cut. That looks like it goes into the house. Yeah, I don't think we want to cut that. I think that's... Oh, wait, there's a couple here. I see. Okay, so I got it. So that one goes into the house. Let me just follow this again. Sorry, let me follow this. It might actually be this wire. That one might be fine. But if that goes out into the into the forest or whatever, that might be the one we need to cut.
I mean, I see it, but from there, where does it go? I just want to see if it proceeds, because where am I facing? Right? If it, if, hold on, I'm going to follow down. Yeah, which then splits. Which goes that way, though. That might not have anything to do with it. Like, where are we? That might not have anything to do with it. I hope this doesn't automatically cut it. I changed my mind. Do I have to climb? Can I change my mind when I'm up here? Or do I have to commit to this now? I really hope not. I hope she says something once we get up here. Mm, I don't think this is the right pole. Okay, she did say something. Good. Why do they make you climb all the way the fuck up there, though, you know? So it's probably a pole we haven't spotted yet. See like, how it, like... So let's see, map. Fourth position of German military vehicles. Yeah, it's been it's been a little bit slower. I'm I'm still intrigued, don't get me wrong, but in terms of like shocking imagery, it's really only happened at the beginning. I mean, based on this, we already know that there must be, like, a, a certain pole that's somewhere else. Because, like, that one obviously goes into the house. We can't use that one. That one's that one's done. So we sure shit don't want to touch that one. But there's another one somewhere that we're not... But it wouldn't be that obvious, would it? it they wouldn't just be like, well, you know, it's being disguised. I'm just going to go back to the grave. I feel like the position of that will, or, like, you know, information for that will be revealed shortly. It might be something, like, we might end up finding the, the bunker and... You know, go from there. Hey, Bix, how's it going? I don't want to spend too much time dicking about. You know, otherwise we'll be here all day. But the com tail, or ta sorry, com tower cable, whatever. I guess we'll deal with it. I, I think the, I think it's, I think it might make itself apparent. Like I said, as we go. And then we'll try and summon the white lady. So I think it's the one... Well, actually, the, let me look at the photo again. Hold on. Yeah, it's not... the. It's actually the middle one. Sorry. It's not this one. It's this one. If I wear this, it should allow me to make contact with her. With this object, she'll have to hear me, I have no doubt. Now that I have everything I need to communicate with the lady, I can finally go to the island. Let's head over there. So she probably wouldn't have let me even go to the island anyway, you know? I'm, I'm kind of going out in the middle. I'm looking for a random comm t cable. You know, if I, I see anything. The problem is the trees look a lot like them. I think that's their point. Because we are able to kind of snoop around surprisingly a lot. Yeah, the, well, the bunker's back there, so I guess that doesn't really say much. We're actually approaching the spot where Lupo was shot. So, yeah, there are boundaries to keep you in the playing area. Like, see, I can't go there.
Wait, where are we? Okay, yeah. I wonder if there's anything gonna be there. If I if I if I like take a left instead of going that way. If we go this way, are we gonna find like some blood on the ground or something like that? As revenge, the oppressed people grab the slaughterer by the throat. Adolf Hitler, the Italian Communist Party. Revenge for Lapo. All right, well, we found that. So they've been in here again. That's the thing. They've been here again. But let's progress this story. It's been a minute. I've been looking for these telephone poles. I just don't like missing anything. You know, I'm, I'm just, like, obsessed with making sure I have 100% of everything. Which can be, I know, kind of a... Not the best. I haven't really been over in this area, though. So I wonder if there's something there. Like, there looks like there's a building... In that region. What's up with that? Hmm. Let's just stick to the script here. They won't let me go down there. They're going to make me go around the long way. All right, to the island we go, fam. Do I actually have to, like, drive it, or is it just gonna be automatic? Probably automatic. Oh, I'm actually driving it. I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of annoying. It's the most annoying engine I've ever heard. Oh, it actually it just turned me automatically. Wait a minute. See, I was trying to go here. I don't understand why mother mother into me and Martha to use it. Man, that's so fucking irritating. What is that? I can't tell. Oh, it's just shit on the rock, I guess. I'm trying to take a right, but it won't let me. I'm trying to turn right. I'm, I'm trying to turn right. It won't let me. I'm dead ass. Like, it won't let me turn. I'm screwed, I'm stuck. It lets me turn left, but it doesn't let me turn right. I guess we're gonna have to turn left and turn right, if that makes sense. No, it's doing it this- Dude, what the fuck game? Come on. I can't get around it, I swear to you. Turn left. Thank you. There's some weird lock, like, lock in there. I gotta park this stupid loud bitch. Listen to that baby burn like a kid. How do you dock it? Okay, space bar. Jesus Christ. Well, the lady ain't gonna be here now. We just get the fuck out of her. She's completely gone. Hello? Man, that was the... Like, in this beautiful, serene little lake... You just hear this, like, loud, obnoxious engine that sounds like, like a fucking, you know, I don't know, like a, like a razor blade thrown into a blender, which was thrown into a wood chipper, which was then thrown into a tornado, which was then thrown into a fucking, you know, Death Star blowing up the planet. That's what it sounded like. This is the tree the lover was hung from, according to the legend. 
That's what I mean. The, there's, there's, the audio balance in this game isn't that good. Like, some things are loud, some things are quiet. It's fucking annoying. What about the film? A roll of film? It's the one that I was taking out of the camera just before I discovered Martha's body. It should contain shots from before that moment. With a bit of luck, one of the shots has captured the moment of Martha's murder. I will then finally have an answer. Was it really Mummy? I doubt it. I will it. develop it as soon as I can, but now it's time to speak with the White Lady. Dude, she's not going to talk to you. I will wear her lover's cross to draw her to me. Yikes. You have to cut that much off? A lock of my hair to enter into her world. I will use the tarot cards to communicate with her. The first ten will be used like I did with Nanny. Once two cards have been chosen, it should begin. So hold a minute. Wait, Nanny was dead? I think Nanny was dead, right? The woman we talked to? I don't know. I'm, I'm fucking, I'm a little behind. Next, I will play patty cake with the deceased. You camouflage yourself in the woods to approach me. You blend in with the water to make yourself known. You wish to communicate with me through the energy of symbols. You use my pain to summon me. Kind of mean. You are very bold. Yes, madam. You call upon me for knowledge that I do not possess. For answers I do not have. I am only a vessel. Like water, like air. A vessel to move and breathe. It worked. Now I need to choose two cards. Here we go. Okay, does it matter? Like... Again, I got the hangman. Bro, I've already got that today. Fool. You, what are you trying to will say? no longer be able to tell light from darkness. In sorrow, the difference is so subtle. You are alone, and you will remain alone. Memories are abandoning you. They are your only true companions. Now they take the place of your happy childhood. And they may return to keep you company. Well, that didn't sound very good. The daughter, the house, the mother. The daughter comes from the mother's house, then makes herself a home and becomes a mother. This cycle is broken. To undo the knot, find the son. He is the original sin reflected on you. The one who gave you the light wishes to take it back. She wants control. Bit by bit, she is crumbling your life. You have to stop her. I could have told you that. Part of our soul embraces the people we love. 
It is then torn away from us when these people disappear. The wound is deep and it cannot heal. Faith vacillates. Death causes fear. But the church is a safe place. It is home and mother to its children. Faith is the light. Do not lose it. Finding it again is almost impossible. I lost it in sorrow, and without time, I am lost in the dark. I can sense that you want to know who did it, but I do not have the answer. You must find it yourself. Do not ever try to enter through the front door if you wish to reach the heart. Your twin sister might have the answer you are looking for. Even after death, we leave traces of ourselves, don't we? Everything is indefinite if you look at the essence of things. You do not have control of yourself. There is a dark figure inside you. The wounds are feeding it. It will do things you do not like. It will use your desires, your guilt, the darkest parts of your conscience. All right, she's out. Okay. Give me that. Moon Achievo. Minor wall. Oh shit. Oh, okay. I'm moving around. Okay, let's go. I got pulled underwater. That wasn't nice. She could have just said, hey, give me the necklace. I'd be like, sure, here you go. No problem. I have no need for it. Oh, it won't let me above water? That's alarming. that it looks like a lantern like a street post oh oh this is the island the tree that she she like hanged from Speaking with the white lady confused me even more. Do you think At that's... At least now I have this key. What key? What is it for? Do you think that's for your, your... Your crib? Oh, I can't open the map. Oh, that could be her box. That's probably her box right here. She did say she kept things, right? July 16th. Dear sister, I entrust my secrets to this letter. If you are reading it, things have gone as I thought they might, and I am no longer there with you. First of all, I am not deaf, and I never was. Mother scared me when we were little, so I decided not to speak or listen anymore. It worked. In fact, mother began to love me. 
they also found a scientific explanation for my deafness. Neurological damage caused by excessive pressure exerted by the twin during pregnancy progressively led to hearing loss. And like that, my decision was also transformed into a fault of yours. So I must put it right. Do I have any other secrets? Unfortunately, yes, but a letter is too cold for such matters. Now that you know that I can speak, please go to the dark room. I have a hidden recording. Listen to it and you will hear my voice. Farewell, Martha. Okay. Why all of this madness, Martha? What else have you been hiding from me? You deprived me of your voice for more than 15 years. I can't wait to hear it now. Are they just spawn me in the dark room? There is nothing here. Nor here. Only one more place to search. That wasn't really hidden. That was just put away, honestly. Sounds just like We're mine. in this sense, too. Well, it's obvious, really. I've basically always spoken, and you were my voice. I'm going to meet my fate, so I don't want there to be any more secrets between us. Wait, why is... Martha's sleeping, so she's here now. So we're still playing as Julia? Oh, it's a few days prior. I'm pregnant, Julia. I'm pregnant with Lapo's baby. We had sex, and I never had the courage to tell you. I was so afraid of hurting you. I'm so ashamed. And now, how can I ever bring this child into the world? The baby is starting to show. Could you tell? That's why I'm no longer getting undressed in front of you. But for how much longer can I hide it? Yesterday, you asked me to go to the lake together early in the morning. You, the sleepyhead, early. I asked you to switch beds with me, like we used to when we were little. Oh, that's why she's on that side. So that is Julia. I wake you. I put on one of your dresses. I see. So she slept with Lupo. Probably him. He I probably wrote a card thought. To mother telling her that it was you no, who he was didn't. pregnant, not me, and to come and see at the lake. I left it on the desk in her room. So she took herself out of the picture. Makes sense. So, okay. I was going to say, maybe he didn't realize who he was with, but then he said, I don't know how you can't tell the, di like, people can't tell them apart. So he must have known that he was with Martha and not Julia. Isn't this the desk or we have to go upstairs? Okay, I'm trying to click it. I'm trying to click it, guys. It won't let me. Thank you. Then I felt the need to talk to you, and I remembered the recorder in the dark room. Bitch! Ugh. Whoa, like sauce. Let me guess, we're going to end up finding something here. I'm assuming the key will pop up down the line. It's going to, like, so maybe something with Martha is going to reveal itself. I will itself. go to the lake alone and act as you. I will tell her everything you never had the courage to tell her. I will be your voice. I know how much she's made you suffer over the years. Unlike you, I remember all of the harm she has done to you, and it is my fault. Take my place, sister. You will live a better life, and I will be able to rest in peace, knowing that I at least try to put right what I have done wrong. I will go now. My last memory will be the image of you sleeping peacefully.
So Martha hey, took the took the L I was for upset. her. Unbelievably upset. July sixteenth, that cursed what day. What a courageous Martha act! Didn't wake me up. There was a dress missing from my wardrobe. Martha wasn't there, and we were supposed to go to the lake together. She even made her bed, which was unusual. I thought Mother woke up early, despite her medication, and asked her to do something. So many layers here. Yeah, exactly. I heard her speak. So she was there, man. Where am I going? It was late. Martha hadn't woken me up as we had agreed. And I always overslept. I guess it doesn't mean mom killed her, but I think that's what she I thought. I simply decided to go out and Martha. take the photographs by myself without Martha. Can I open the door? Thank you. Is there anything here we should... I mean, this is a flashback, so we're probably not going to be able to pick anything up. If I open up the map... Oh, I can't even open the map. So, yeah, there's nothing I can pick up right now. It was a foggy morning, but it was no longer dawn. It was a sign of something terrible. My mother had killed her beloved Martha with her own hands. I had then taken her place, usurping the throne of her affection. She would have never forgiven me. I had real reason to be afraid. Yeah, because she would have thrown on one of Martha's dresses. So yeah, they pulled the old swisheroo. But... I searched for one of Daddy's mm. pistols to defend myself. What a stupid little girl I was. In spite of everything, that roll of film still needed developing. Even if it didn't prove she was guilty. I also wanted to search for proof of Martha's pregnancy. So is this current? Yeah, it must be present day. Well, obviously. Okay, so that means we must have access to our objectives again. Develop the photo. I wonder if there's anything else we could phone. Still haven't found the keys. Strange note. Oh, go to the cemetery. Right, so that's part of this one. 22nd, okay. I hate how they do that. You can't hit escape, but you have to actually quit German close. Divisions face the troops of the 8th Army. Units of an Indian division cross the river Pesa General Edith K. New rules on curfew and women's stop. behavior. Can we read this German already? German command of S. Vicenzo Atori. Telephone number 1185. Near La Romola, the Michelangelesk villa of the E family, where General K was staying, was bombed by the artillery. Luckily, the general and his Should I try phoning some bechas? Cemetery, 6537.
Hello, it's at NAK. Yeah? Yeah, and wh what do you want from me? How dare you, you disrespectful cretin! Oh, and I'm the rude one? <laughs> You're the one who's a filthy traitor. Just look at this bitch! What? He must be going crazy. I don't believe for one second that Mummy would let him treat her this way. Sheer madness. Can I call him back? I've already called this number. Oh. What use would there be calling again? So did I fuck up? Yeah. 6938. Maybe we'll try that one now. I thought she was a bitch. That's why I answered that way. Father, you must bring justice for Lapo. You know it wasn't really him who killed Martha. I know that it wasn't Lapo, and your father already knows this. Believe me. But I can't do anything. These are dark times, my dear girl. Come to see me soon, and we will talk about it. I see, okay. Alright, I, I can call him again later. Six five nine three. Let's try that. Love Ravana, doctor's surgery. How may I help? I don't know who to act as. Oh, h hello, it's at NAK. Please wait a moment. Doctor, it's that strange girl, Irene's daughter. Hi, Julia. Why? I didn't say that. Yes, it's me, Doctor. It's Julia. Excuse me for... Don't worry, Julia. You needn't be ashamed. How are you? Any chest pain? I'm okay, Doctor. The pain is almost gone. But Mother seems to be getting ill again. I mean, in the head, basically. I saw that she is taking that medicine again. Pervitin, I think. Irene is very shaken by everything that's happening. But I don't think there is any need to worry. I saw her recently, and she's doing well, all things considered. Her vitin was made illegal in Italy a few years ago now, so I wouldn't have prescribed it to her. But they say that it is still used in the army. Maybe they could give you some information at the German command. I'll call I them must right go now. now, Julia. I will come to see you soon. So you had to get that I don't information. Have the German command's number, but I'm sure it won't be hard to find amongst father's things. It's right there. You do have Perhaps it. What are you talking about? Study? It's right there. I already found it a while ago. Yeah, they found out that Julia was alive. There was a moment in this story that happened. What's up, Onyx? Command of San Vincenzo Atori, identify yourself. I am the daughter of General Edic K. I am looking for information on Pervitin. We cannot give you any kind of information here. I found the drugs in my house, so I took a few pills thinking that they were for headaches. But now I don't feel well. I need help. I'm not sure whether I should go to the doctor, should I? Uh, please wait a moment, miss. Uh, Captain, I've got a woman on the line who says she has taken pervitin and doesn't feel well. Hello? 
How many pills did you take? I took two pills, I think. Or maybe three? Any unwanted effects will go away quickly, miss. Just try and stay calm. I wonder if I should have said a lot. That way I couldn't find out that it maybe been like a poisonous thing. So let's go back. So I can call the dawn again later. Everyone else has been phoned, so I got information there. Let's go to the cemetery. Must check her body. Okay, well let's go. Wait, oh we got we got these. More diary stuff. Hold up, I'll 21st be back. of July. Lapo is dead. They shot me in the back when I discovered his body. I thought I had hit rock bottom. These are soulless, empty days. After so many awful events, I finally managed to meet the White Lady. Or so I believe. The line between reality and dreams is becoming less and less clear to me. I thought a lot about her words, but they didn't shed any light on my assumptions. They kept ringing in my mind. Maybe I will understand when the time comes. Now I know for certain that it was Mummy who killed Martha, when she thought that she was me. Only a week ago, all of this would have seemed impossible. I just need to find the proof, so she can pay for what she has done. Sorry about that, guys. We don't know for a fact, though. I mean, based on that, um, that doesn't mean that your mom did do it. You know, we don't actually know that yet. We could find proof. We could find out it was someone else. We don't know that. More tarot readings. So, guys, I just had to get a snack because there'll be no lunch today. care about what people think. Or fear will prevent me from facing the music. It will be very difficult to recover from the mental collapse. Oh, I got more? Destiny is inevitable. The end waits for us. That doesn't sound good. The wheels of fortune has got achievement. What does that mean? Carried out a div divination every day. Wait a minute. So we're on the last day? Already? Let me call the dawn again, then. Guys, this is the final day. 6938. If he doesn't answer, that's probably later. Not now. Okay. What's this? 400 ISO film. It comes into its own shooting clouds and indoors. Must have missed that. The Hanged Man achievement. What's that one? Collected all camera accessories. Look at me go. The picture's finished. Reminds me of Layers of Fear. So with that in mind... I gotta go to the cemetery. How do I even get there, though? 
program. I'll leave it in the letterbox. Have a good day. Thanks. Another telegram of condolence. Isn't it a bit late? It's probably for Martha now. You've got mail. The New Zealanders conquer Tavernelli in the eastern sector of the battlefront. The troops of the 2nd New Zealand Division, British 8th Corps, conquer Tavernelli. The 6th South African poor, Armored not Division poor. advances on poor. the heights near Greve, conquering the peaks of the Domini and Philly Mountains. The 4th Division reaches San Giovanni. The stars. I'm guessing that means I got all the, um... Um... All the newspaper clippings? Yeah, every newspaper edition read. Bombings. Damage caused by the bombings between Florence and Siena continues to increase. After the disaster at Poggibonsi, rubble and power cuts are the order of the day. Attack on Hitler. After an attack carried out by a group of traitors, Hitler's words are... In having escaped, I see a sign of the duty incumbent on me to continue my work. Sabotage of the phone lines in La Romola. Telephone cables have been cut, causing danger to general safety. Any damage to the information service facilities is punishable by death. I haven't cut shit yet, so maybe that's a good thing. Hmm. Dear Mrs. Irene K, following your call, we have received a telegram from Dr. D. Your request has been accepted. As soon as the police station issues authorization, we will send for the girl. This bitch! While we wait, to avoid the girl taking any extreme actions, as per the fears you have expressed, we ask that you trust in the advice of her treating physician. I thank you for your generous and charitable donation to our institution. Director S. Volterra Psychiatric Hospital, telephone 0782. Now this that bitch. she has discovered everything, she wants to lock me up in an asylum. Or maybe even worse, she wants to kill me and have everyone believe it was suicide. She is preparing all the finer details. Old photographs that father took of this house. Harry Potter and the audacity of this bitch. We gotta find the deets, guys. Commune of San Casciano. Province of We've already France. read this. So now she knows it's the wrong death certificate, so does that mean... Mother's a bitch. We literally have no clue. I mean, I know I have to phone... I'll tell you what. Let me go here. Oh, the communication cable is there. It, it tells me where it is. I didn't realize that. Okay, we'll have to phone the asylum. Let's go cut the cable then. Fuck them, that's why. Dante's Inferno illustrated by Dore. Always hanging cheery things. That looks horrible. I mean, it's dark as hell in this room. So the cable that's been split. So let me ask, where in the balls is the cemetery? I'm not sure. Okay, let me see, am I getting, yeah, I must be getting close. It seems like it's on the other side of the river. This is the one that splits, correct? Yeah, it's this one. I mean, I might as well cut it. They say it's punishable by death, so I'm almost like, do I cut it? But it also helps the allies in the war effort, so it's kind of like... I don't know, you know? I don't know if there's multiple endings or not. That I'm not sure. I mean, I've already made my bed. I might as well lay in it, you know what I mean? A German tank. I have to report its location via the telegraph hidden near the cowshed. Daddy probably asked for a garrison after all that has happened. 
I should report its location via telegraph. This wire heads towards the house and then keeps going, so it must be the right one. I really hope it is, because I'll be salty as shit. Now all that remains is to go to the telegraph near the barns. If I can't make a phone call now because I cut the wrong cable, I'll be mad. I don't think so, though. I think it's a separate cable. I mean, to the Germans, though... We still got to develop the front. They wouldn't let you just not do that. Go to the lake tomorrow morning at 7 and watch it. All right. Where is the cemetery? Like, is that it there? Yeah, it looks like it. I wonder if I can actually walk there. That, that'd be a pretty big playing field. I love how I read the fact that it's punishable by death and I just go in and cut the bitch anyway like a boss. That's some gangsta shit right there. That is a gangsta move. Okay, where is it? Oh, wait. No, it is this. It's by the generator, then. The telegraph must be hidden in one of these feed bins. to start every message with the code word. I saw the tank on the road, and the road is near the house. I guess I have to communicate something like that. Okay, um... Can I look at the, the map? Just for a minute, let's... Yes. Don't close the whole thing. I can't remember what it said. Oh, damn it. Don't close. That's so annoying. I just wanted to check this. Where is it? Remember the code word town on fire. Town on fire. Town on fire. Hey, Travis. Yeah, I'll be playing the full game. There can't be much left of it. I have to start every message with the code word. I saw the tank on the road, and the road is near the house. Tank. I guess I have to communicate something like that. Okay, so I get it. Town. Town on fire. Town on fire. Tank. Tank on. Is there an on? Tank. Tank. Is it? There's no on. Tank located road. Maybe that. Tank located on road. There's no on, which is kind of odd. There's an on fire. Tank located road near. I saw a near somewhere. Need near. 
house. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'll add over at the end to make it clear that I have finished. Like over and out or just over? Over. Holy fuck, bro. Okay, what? This is this is crazy. So dots Um So dot three dots is a V. Wait. Oh, I see it could be an S or a V. So three dots can be an S or a V, right? So S or V, and then it's space, so it's a line, or it's a dash. I don't fucking get it. <laughs> so it's S or V, received maybe? Received. I don't understand how this works. I'm I'm confused as shit. Follow the dots or dashes to get the correct letter. Like are these numbers? Like what? I don't I don't know how to fucking read Morse code. I'm sorry, I don't. This is the most confusing shit I've ever seen. Yeah, I gotta decode it. I know, yeah. It's just. I don't know what this means. This doesn't make sense to me. No, I know. I know that's. I know it's the first letter. I get it. I just don't know what three dots means. Now, I know, Cognito. I know. I know that part. I just don't know what three dots equates to. Like, what letter is the is the three dots? Like, I don't understand what this this is all about. Like, it doesn't make sense. Like, where, where does it start? Where do I look? Do I start at E? You know? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I, my God. I know. I get that part. I get it. I just don't get what the letters they stand for. Fuck. <laughs> that part we've established. But we don't know that. It could be three dots. Could be V. And then one dash. But the, okay, so S, S or V, it's one of the two. Um, space.
or a dash, sorry. I guess that's a space, so that counts as one word, right, or whatever, so that's dash, that, dash dot. Oh, I see, like dash dot. I don't know how to fucking read this. So, okay. Well, I figured it was received. I, but I, 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 I want to make sure I understand this for the future. Just because... SRV. See, now I'm getting mixed things. Do we know what means received? Oh, fuck. I don't know. It looks like there's three things. Fuck, I am, I'm not, apparently not smart enough to understand this. Um, what sucks is this is kind of dark too. I wish it was brighter so I could actually correspond. Okay, follow the dots of the dashes to get the correct letter. Okay, yeah, I wouldn't... Ooh. So, dot, three dots. But why is there a V under there, too? That's what I don't fucking understand. Why is there a V? Okay, well, received makes sense. Okay, no, I see you. I, I see that. Yeah, no, my goodness. I, I, I understand that. I understand that's a word, 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 that's a word. I understand that's one letter, that's another letter. I understand that. I get that. Like, word, letter, letter, letter. I understand. I, I, I'm not, that's not what I'm not, that's not what I'm confused about. What I don't understand is how does, how does, how does you come, how do you come up with this as an S over a V? Like, how is that an S? This has three dots, so that should have three dots too. Unless, of course, it's just like they use the same thing for each letter and based on what comes after, you have to kind of decode it. So a space and a dot, what I can't figure out is how is the dash and a dot, how do you correspond that to its own letter? Like where does it say dash dot? You know what I mean? Does it go one dash? Like I look for a single dash and then a dot? Like I don't, that fucking makes no sense to me. Because if you say it's SN, if you say it's SN, how in the hell does it, how is this an N? Wouldn't that mean a dash? Or is that a dot? That's a dash. That's a dot. V has three dots. Yes, it does. S has two dots. So would that be V something? Near? No, because there's only two letters. Let me see this. Here's what I'm doing. <laughs> Morse code translator. <laughs> oh my gosh. Type your message. Oh, I don't want to type it. I want to know the reverse. No, I want Morse to text. There you go. Okay, let's try this. Okay. Let's see. So, dot, dot, dot. Why can't it translate them? You liar. What? The dash is for counting. That makes no sense to me. I, I literally am... My brain cannot figure this shit. I don't know what that means. For one dot, you move to the right in the tree. For a dash, you move to the left in the tree. What?
Oh! Oh, I, I think I get what you're saying now. Oh, I get it. Okay, I think I get it. I think I got it. So essentially, three dots is one, two, three. I get it. Okay, I, I totally misunderstood that. I thought it meant like you had to count three dots and you got to ask. Okay, so if it's three dots, it's one, two, three. And then it's right, left, right, left. Okay, now see, that's what I needed to comprehend. Okay, so that makes sense. So one, two, three to the left, S. So that's S. And then it, this one is dash dot. So it's T N. So S N. I got it. That was confusing, but thank you for explaining that. I literally could not figure that fucking shit out. So the first word is receive. So that case, it should be S. So same thing, one, two, three, S. So uh, left, so E. A R so R so S R so probably S R V then my guess uh, one two three S R V yeah need received need um so okay T and so D D uh okay D one two U F D F S. What's DFS? DFS. Defensive. Uh, so, okay. So E A R L. So it's L N line. All right. Uh, M. Oh, so it's just M. So M. Uh, and then hold on. Okay. M E A. W P so M P P probably map I would imagine just to just to confirm yeah map defensive line map uh so E A so L S L S wait is there an L S already oh, it's probably L well it could be L S yeah it's probably L S C Right? So it's like right, left. So right, left, right, left. Yeah, LSC. Receive, need, defensive line map. Leave SV. Right? SV. So V. It's probably VCN again. Because that's the only V on there. Uh. Or wait, no, no, no. It wouldn't be, would it? It's something else. Hold on a second. Uh, let's see. Do that again. So, hold on. One, two, three, four. So, yeah. So, it's V. Uh, hmm. 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 VC. Probably near. Uh, and then, uh, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, VCN. So, leave near. Um, okay. So, E. D. F. EDF. Building. Uh, can you imagine the guys waiting on the other end for my response? Okay. Uh, F. I. Sorry. F I. U. F I U. River. Receive. Need defensive line map. Leave near building river. River what? Oh, leave near building river. Okay, so we got to give the, the defensive line map that's in his uh, study or whatever. Leave near. Uh, okay, one. A. R. Over and over. Okay. Okay. So, is that all I do? You just exit the telegraph? So, now that I know what he says, I get the map and I bring it to them. I leave it near the river. So, is there anything else I do or is just... We're done here. No. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, we're done. That was a complicated thing. I apologize for that. That made no sense to me. I didn't understand the legend. I thought I knew what it meant, but apparently I wasn't. 
So Cognito, thank you for explaining that and being patient with me. Because that was confusing. I was getting frustrated. But once I once once this, once I actually understood, it made way more sense. Now that was going above and beyond, so we are going to go. Well, it says. I hope I don't have to redo that whole thing. That'd be balls. So I had to cut the wire so I was able to actually telegraph or not tell, you know what I mean? Be able to do that effectively. What's up, Gam? So far, so good. I hope I didn't have to submit anything or else I'll be pissed because I'll have to do it again. Whoa. How do I take this? Isn't this a defensive line map? Did I? Maybe I didn't submit it. Did I fuck something up by mistake? I'm confused. Did I? I mean, that's the map I need. I didn't see a submit section, guys. Ugh, I think I have to redo it. I don't know. I really hope not. That is fucking annoying if that is the case. It didn't say I did it. I said leave, but I didn't see an option to submit. So unless I had to reply with something else, I don't... They tell you that in the Boy Scouts? I didn't think they would. Seems like it's a bit of an outdated tech to me. I don't think it counted. That's really rude. If it didn't. Fuck, man. I didn't see... I don't know if it was... It didn't give me a prompt. I don't know if I was just supposed to go over there. I don't know. I have to start every message with the code word. I saw the tank on the road, and the road is near the house. I guess I have to communicate something like that. Fuck. All right. Town on fire. Town on fire. Um... Sorry, town on fire, tank. Uh, did I say near? Or did I just say tank road? Tank located or something, right? Tank positioned. Might be positioned. Tank located, road, near house. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh wait, no, it's not over now, it's just over. Over, where's over, sorry. That's really dumb. It mustn't have, uh, I mustn't have submitted it. I thought I was looking for something. It's gonna be the same message, right? Unless I got, I translated one of the words wrong. 
It's entirely possible. Okay, uh, received. Um, what was it again? Fuck, I can't remember them. I don't know if I do have to decrypt it again. I'm confused whether or not it's, like, actually saving it. S R V. Um, fuck, I really don't want to do this again. Right, left, left, D. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. D, F. Defensive. Receive, need, defensive line map near... No, that's not it. Need, defense... Uh, sorry, uh, E. A, so L... N line mm -hmm. M mm -hmm. MP map uh, E mm -hmm. L uh, L S C Leave. I think it was near. I'm just being thorough, that's all. S. V is V. VCN, near. E. Is there any E1s? How many E1s are there? Near building, right? Yeah. EDF. Okay, sorry, my brain is slowing down. <laughs> I F I F I River and over, right? Mm hmm. A A R. Was it over and out, or was it just A R, or was it over? No, it was A R. So, does it not... So, does it... The thing is, I've decrypted it, but it won't let me grab the defensive line map. It's not saying I've completed it. You know what I'm saying? No, something's wrong. Better try again. What do you mean, something's wrong? Dude, that was it! Oh my god. This is so annoying. I have to, I, I obviously have to finish it. I thought I was on the right, maybe I was on the wrong one. So, it was, so I was right about something. So, received. Let me just say remove. Okay, so received. Why did it say it was white, though? It's, maybe I skipped a letter. It's possible I skipped the letter. Received. My brain already fucking forgot. I'm so dumb. I don't want to keep, I'm, I'm going to go, I don't know. S... Uh, yeah, R, S, R, S, V, wait, 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 what? S, S, wait, hold on, what was it? S, R, V, need, yeah, okay. Um, so I must have missed, I must have, like, when I clicked one, I might have skipped a word. It's possible I skipped a word. T, D, I, F, so D, F. S. I must have skipped something. Wait, DFS. Yeah, defensive. Mm -hmm. L. N. Right line. Oh, did I miss beside river? I probably missed beside river. 
Okay, receive need. Let's try that. Receive need, defensive line. Oh, wait. Receive need, defensive line. No, go back. Defensive line, map. Leave near. Leave near. Building. I, I think I missed building. Where's building? Building. No, I didn't. I might have missed beside. River. Where's river? Receive need defensive line map. Leave near building beside river. But there's still one letter that's... Oh, and then over and out. There it is. Me to find okay. The defensive line. There is one in my father's study. So we got it, but it was just like I forgot to put over and out or something. And then the second time I did it, I didn't put near river or build. I didn't put building or something. So I kept missing a word and I traded it. It's cool, but man, I'm too stupid for that. Obviously, <laughs> it's a good thing I wasn't alive in the '40s, man. I wouldn't have been able to call anybody. I wouldn't be able to contact anybody. That's how you text back in the day. That was really bad. I'm sorry, guys. And then I couldn't remember the order of it. It's just like, oh, brutal. I was so worried not to mess up that I'm just like, what was it? And I, I decoded again and again and again and again and again and again. It's okay. We, we Hopefully, we got it that time. But I don't know if this is going to, like, progress the story. You know, I feel like some of them do. Uh, and then, oh, I have to do that anyway. Okay. Um, let's take a photo of it then. Out of focus. That's it. Hopefully the image comes out clearly. Nope. Okay, let's go check our objectives. Print the photo. I mean, I don't want to do that yet. I got to call the asylum too. I almost forgot about that. The happy room I still got to. I mean, the cemetery, I think... That's a good question, Tracy. Modern Morse code. I wonder if it even would uh, you'd be able to even use it. Oh, sorry, I gotta go to the basement. See, I'm a little, I'm a little nervous. Alpha, I was I paying attention to you. Now. Relax. Not when she's around. Oh wait, I just I missed must mother. Stay as far away from her as possible. I could go to the cemetery instead. I saw, but not everybody was correct. Some people were, pregnant. and I did end up reading it again. But some people were incorrect or slightly wrong. That's why I wasn't looking at chat. I was because because they weren't all necessarily correct. I looked, and there wasn't enough letters in some of them. So take a chill pill on that. Wait, I, wait, I have to go to the cemetery now. Then, so before I can even do that, I have to. I will develop the films later. So I can't even do that yet. So maybe I can phone the asylum? 0782. Man, it's dark here. Hello, we recently requested the admission of Julia Kay to the hospital. I just wanted to know whether it would be possible to cancel the request. I'm sorry, but the request was issued by the municipality where you reside, madam. Any revocation of the request should be passed by them. Only they can decide whether to approve the cancellation or not. Have you already received the telegram confirming that we have taken charge of the request? Should I say yes? Yeah. Yes, I just received the telegram. Okay, so the admission will continue at this time. You Shit. can get back in touch with our institution later for more information. So it's going to happen Please anyway. Please bear in mind that everything will depend on the designated doctor's assessment. Please come here in person around one month after the admission. Thank you. Goodbye, madam. All right, well, now I'm going to go to the cemetery. I think it's actually a part of this. I can actually just go down the street. 
It won't let me go in there yet, so mother's in the basement just being a bitch. Okay, so I have to actually go down this way. Wait, what's the gothic line? Print the photo. And bring it to the agreed place. Well, I can't because I can't get down there. So I have to do a bunch of back and forth. So I'm going to go back. I'm going to go to the cemetery then. God damn it, I hate that. Am I going the right way? Yes, just follow this. It's a lot of shit to do. Grim, oh, Grim, I know. We tried that. We tried trying. We tried the Italian thing, but based on people's viewing situations, it was easier just to have English. I was originally doing that system, but it was easier to have English because people couldn't necessarily see the subtitles. So I felt we felt that more people were gonna miss it than we're gonna get it. You know what I mean? I originally was like, yeah, no, we should probably. I'm gonna go this way for a second. There's been minor jump scares so far, like like little, very very minor. Go to the town now. Oh. What are these ideas that randomly pop into my head? Hey Tyler. I mean, mostly this has just been a lot of like going one place, going another kind of thing. All right, that's where we got to drop it. But Martha is in the family crypt. That place is scary. I can't believe this I is actually remember, movable. I thought... Nanny told me we used to go there when we were kids to see who was brave enough to go down the stairs. No one would ever go further than the first two steps. Now Martha's down there, alone, in the dark. She must be frightened. Whoa, lag sauce. Sometimes that happens when things load in. Oh, hey, yeah, welcome back. Uh, unfortunately, I think you might have missed quite a few things. The crypt is here. Yeah, I have no idea what happened with ghosts either, Tyler. I was looking Not for now. information, and I found absolutely Let's nothing. Nothing from the devs. Around. Just, it's gives me been quiet. Why do you live so close to a grave? Do you think some of these people are devs? Oh, there's Gloria. No, not Gloria. Who am I thinking of? She said she was buried in the crypt, right? Family crypt. Among all those keys, one of them must be for the family crypt. Yeah, the face peeling was pretty aggro. To say the least. This door is On the locked, bolt cutters. I must get in. Maybe I can find something around here to break the lock. But yeah, this is mainly... This is psychological horror. It's not a... Like a, a horror game. It's all mental fuckery. These are perfect for breaking the lock. I should hurry before the caretaker comes back. I haven't seen that, but it sounds like Death Day. Was that Death Day? Enough. I can't go on like this any longer. I can't go on pretending nothing happened. My family was slaughtered by these dirty Nazis. My daughter wasn't even buried, and I had to bury that half-blood instead. An Italian family that got cozy with the dirty Germans. Bastards, that's what they are. What am I supposed to do with my life now? It's a bit aggro, bro. I want to end it, but not without taking a few Germans down with me. You won't see me anymore, but you will hear about me. Long live the resistance. Viva Italia. Everyone takes a side. I find myself siding with my family, but I'm not sure whether it is right. It's not. Instructions for the automatic telephone machine. 
For example, if you wish to call the number 0573, pick up the telephone from the hook and bring the receiver to your ear. Instructions. You will hear a continuous tone. Firstly, place your index finger in the hole displaying the number zero. Turn the disc clockwise until it stops. Let the disc return freely to its resting position. Repeat the same steps for the numbers five, seven, three. Is that a new number? I don't know. Anyway, I've actually used a phone like that. My grandma had one of those ones where like you actually hold the fucking thing, right? And that's where the, and then you actually hold the piece up to your like this. You know, my grandma actually had one and my aunt took it and she connected it and it actually worked. Well, it was very simple tech and you actually had to, and then like, I remember I made a phone call to my, like my friend's house with it. It was awesome. Like what? It actually had like a little coil on the side. You hung it up on the side like that. It's pretty neato burrito to be, it had to be said. Is that a skin? Oh fuck. New skin for that. Okay, I think that's everybody. Now we need the crypt key, which I'm not sure which is the crypt. It's not very apparent. It's going to be one of these fuckers, though. Oh, it's probably the one with all the flowers out front. Makes sense. Cri having a crypt would be so expensive. Honestly, to keep me Like, you have to pay, like, you can either buy... I can't remember how it works. The Hermit Achievement Unlocked. What is that for? Opening the crypt. Enter the family crypt. But seriously, like, to be able to pay this and bury someone in your crypt... I can see why we were scared as children. It's a rather gloomy place. Oh, that's a Nazi section. Oh, dear. It's a fucking Nazi section, bro. Come on. I mean, well... Dad's a general. I mean, that's not really imagery. I, I, I don't know. I know I forgive me for what I'm about to do. I also pray that you, Martha, will forgive me. Of course she will. Well, wait, why are we opening her shirt? It's playing the twangy music. That's how you know something fucky is happening. Oh, for the love of God. Are we? Okay. All right. We're checking for, we're checking for pregnancy. That's what we're checking for, guys. Just so you know. It's a little messed up because it's a dead body, so. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna get fucking coffee. I'm gonna get not safe for you two. <laughs> Probably. Oh, no! Oh! No! We are not! Don't try this at all, people! We are not opening her up! Are you shitting me, bro? You're not gonna make me do that! Fuck you! No way! Not do- This was definitely cut from the PlayStation version! Oh, God. And I have to do it! I have to click! I don't wanna click! I've gotta click! Alright, I'm committing! Oh shit! Wu Tang! Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Oh, don't make stop! No, I no, I I'm not. I'm I'm not. I'm not. I swear to fuck, they're making me do this. They've got a gun to my head. That's so wrong. Oh, I, ca I can't do it fast enough. Oh my fucking god. Bro. The squeamish. Look away. 
Oh, holy shit! And I gotta actually manually peel. I gotta feel in there! Oh, no! Dude, no! with a deformed fetus with two heads. Twins again. They always said that it ran in the family. I was all the more shocked. I was doing things that I had never done before. I do not know what force was moving me. It was Everything deformed, was man! Stoppable. I decided to photograph the horror as evidence to show my mother and to everyone. Oh, that's fucking horrible! why. Don't make me photograph it. Don't make me photograph it, you sick fuck. That is a sinister fucking photo in my opinion. Bro, why? Let's just get this shit over with. Oh my god. They weren't fucking kidding. I mean, I gotta get it all in focus, I suppose. That is brutal. Take the damn photo. Now. Take the I damn photo. No longer. I will come back to fix you, and I will stay and take care of you. We will spend so much time together. I love you, Martha. Girl, I, the least you could do is put the fucking cover back on. So that her her unborn child had like a split head. It had two heads, so it was like a conjoined twin. That's wild. Okay. Well, anyway, let's get the fuck out of this crypt, man. I mean, I'm going to see if there's anything else, but that was gross. Let me see the map here. Current objectives. I wonder when we're going to get into that. Oh, my God. A strange note for sure. I must check Martha's body. Well, that's what we just did. Develop the photo of the fetus. Oh my goodness. Well, I have to develop three photos. I have to print it out. I just want to make sure I didn't, for, didn't miss anything at all. I just feel like I don't see anything to pick up. So I'm just going to, I'm just going to leave. That's enough of that. I mean, I will say, it's Doctor, unique. I've never. I must thank you for your help. Oh shit! I wouldn't know what to do without you. Even our own dear Donatilio seems to not understand the situation. Irena, please consider the idea of leaving Italy as your husband suggested. It would be better for everyone, especially for the girl. I fear that nothing will make her better. Her father doesn't want to accept it. I believe that hope is long gone. I agree. But in Germany, there are better treatments in specialized clinics. The asylum is a temporary solution, just to ensure that she doesn't do anything foolish. But it's a nightmarish place. You know that all too well. You cannot possibly want this for your daughter. Of course I don't. Yes, she does. But what can I do? She is a danger to herself, to us, to everyone. One of Eric's guns has also disappeared. She must have taken it. Who else could it have been? I am so scared, Doctor. I cannot wait any longer. Also, you know what they think of Italians in Germany, don't you? But you would be with Erik, an esteemed general. Everyone will respect you. That cursed girl. Where could she be? Let's hope she doesn't play any more foolish stunts. I'll wait for her here, in the cellar. Sooner or later, she'll go to the dark room. That's for sure. I would gladly stay and keep an <clears throat> eye on her. But I must rush to town to organize the last few things for her hospitalization. Thank you, Doctor. Don't worry. We'll see you later. So how do we get her out of the way? Relax. Stop what you're doing. Dude, it's lagging like a fuck. I'm not trying to do this. 
Do I have to confront mother? I don't think I have a choice, guys. I, I gotta... Bro, we've got blood all over our hands, naturally. Can I tiptoe around? She's sleeping. I must take advantage of this. Oh, she's sleeping. I will make her talk. She will reveal the truth out of fear. She thinks I can be silenced by calling me crazy. But unbeknownst to her, I will record everything. Everyone will know what you have done to your own daughter. All right, we're going to we're going to help out, but hold on. But wait a minute. I thought it wanted me to go here. I have to I have to get the photo, so it's like I can't I hope they let me get it out. Like I hope they let I me finish too it. Too much noise and wake her up. Oh, so I can't even develop it, so I have to record. So recording comes first. What about all the other shit? That's what I don't understand. So now I gotta wake her up? I would make too much yeah. noise and wake her up. Wasn't that what we're doing anyway? Now I will wake her up and she will confess. Look at her we hands. Bet on it. This is not going to work. What are you doing, my daughter? Why do you want to ruin your Whoa, life? Whoa, why'd you actually shoot her? It wasn't me who just shot mummy. It wasn't me. Yeah, she wouldn't have shot. What's going on? Dear God, what have I done? She forced me. She killed Martha. But who in the world will believe me now? Fuck me. They will take me to the mental asylum. Those rolls of film are my only hope. Bro, what happened? Okay. Why did she get... Sh did she actually shoot her? Like, I don't understand. Let me guess. That's so the baby room. The keys to my there they kitchen. are. I could have guessed. We were looking for those some bitches all day. Did <laughs> Fuck me. That was loud. Ah. My God. Sooner or later, more bombs will land here. Then everything will come to an Jesus end. Jesus Christ on a salad. Mom just got a knife, but did, no one else could have shot her. There's no one else here. Okay, I got to go develop this film, and then I'm going to go outside to that drop point. Hopefully, it'll let me, and then I will go in. We must be nearing the end of the game now, guys. What is all this stuff? Was that all there before? Damn, the power is out. It's impossible to develop that roll of film now. Dicks. How do we... How do we fire up the... If mom's body was gone, I would have shit my ass apart, honestly. At least now I finally have the keys to my old room. But why was it locked in the first place? Is there any more people to phone? The phone lines should be separate. So we can go there now, but... Let's see if I can actually phone anybody. I can't see it. What's that say? What's... Dawn? What is it? 6938. It's so dark. Julia, father. They've killed my mother. Now nobody's here. What should I do? Where is your father, Julia? I don't have a clue where he is. 
I know that he could help me, but he's never here. You must understand. Your father is a general, and with this war, he has such big responsibilities that... Come here to me, Julia. As soon as possible. I will wait for you. We can talk and figure out what you can do. Wait a minute. What if Julia's father did kill her mother kill her mother what if he killed her there's no we didn't see who shot who we didn't see any of that shit you know god sometimes it really chops up doesn't it all right well we can't develop anything right now so we're gonna have to go to we're gonna go to that childhood bedroom and see what okay see what i mean it chops like a motherfucker at certain spots we've been waiting Finally, to open this door for a while into my room Huh? Stop lagging, God. So annoying. It's like being a child all over again. I used to play with the puppets by reenacting what was happening in my life. To clear my mind. I want to do it again. At the beginning of any puppet act, there was always the legend of the White Lady. Otherwise, the scenes I was reenacting were worthless. According to an ancient legend, the lakes of the area are haunted by the spirit of a young woman who was killed by the man she loved. A lover's nightly tryst by the lake. So much hope and desire that death, not love, was awaiting her. It's a beautiful moon tonight. I'm playing with the puppets. My love is not here yet. I'll wait. You're here at last. <laughs> What's going on? Why are you acting weird? What do you mean, my dear? I'm acting totally normal. You cheated on me. I don't think she did. I would never do that. I love you. Whoa, do I have to? Do I have to kill? I love you too much. The thought of you with another drives me insane. That's why you have to die. What did I do to you? The end. In despair, the man confessed he had killed her out of jealousy. I just want to see if you can do anything extra. They searched everywhere, but the girl's body was never found. Since then, her spirit, known as the White Lady, takes the life of a young woman. Whenever events take her back to that sad day. Is that what happened? <laughs> 
Oh, she's under the water. Help! Help me! <laughs> now I can begin. First of all, let's clarify what happened the night before the cursed 16th of July. to come with me to the lake tomorrow. I want to bathe. Isn't that what she said? to take some photos. Let's go at dawn. Mummy sleeps heavily anyway. You know she's been taking that medicine. Wake me up. Did you see Lapo yesterday? I saw him leave the barn. Weren't you there? She was. Sure, great idea. Yes, it happened like this. Then in the morning, Martha went to the lake pretending to be me to show her pregnancy. She knew Mother was going to follow her down. Now I can only guess what happened when they met at the lake. She spoke. Hello, Mummy. Take off your clothes. I want to see your shame. So you are 
pregnant. Your sister was right. Would she have undressed? That wouldn't have made sense. Get out of the water. Cause she wait, she never undressed, did she? Cause she was in it, so that's wrong. That's not how it went down. I got it wrong, I think that's You want to hurt me, mummy? Yeah, no, she never undressed because she was in the dress. Dum. It's not quite Dum. right. So I got it. I don't know. If... Dum. 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 This doesn't seem very valid yeah. to me, but anything could be true. Can I redo it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I got it wrong. Okay. Um. So she never undressed. I think I got it right. Hello, mummy. Do you think she would have just hit her? Do you think she probably told her that? Take off your clothes. I want to see your shape. She probably refused. No way! I'll take that dress off for you, stupid girl! What do you want from me? Do you think she tried to take her knife? to do with that knife because their clothes were all torn so I'm going to kill you that doesn't seem right either to hurt me mummy I don't she never had a knife did she do I have to use the knife yeah see it's her act unless she did cut her that way or she might have tried dung 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 yes this version is credible okay that's more likely what happened. I will never know exactly what happened, but I think I have an idea. And after everything, I shot my mother. No, 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 I didn't shoot. What actually happened? Well, check, check the magazine. Mind, See how many rounds, if there's remember. rounds in there. I know I can. Literally, just open, literally open, just check the, check, check the magazine. That's what I would do. See if you shot anything. See ya. <laughs> what am I breaking? I'm so confused. A small leg. And another little arm. Another small leg. 
Oh, look, only the head is left. Are you trying to imply that you decapit like delimbed your mother? It seems like even though we didn't see this happen. I don't know, bro. It seems I don't that she's still down there, so unless Maybe she is psycho and, like, gone crazy. Threw her in a fucking bag and chucked her in the river? Oh my goodness. Bruh. Or maybe not the river, but... Unless this is, like, her just... <laughs> thinking about doing it. I was under the bridge, but but it was just a game. She actually did it. This, however, is not a game. What the it hell? It's just playing. It's just a bad joke. Under the bridge, the church. Stop lagging! Oh my Tell god! Me. Speak, the white lady. Dude, it's lagging like a motherfucker. I can't control that. It's like I try to. Why do I have mother's head? How fucking choppy it is when you enter certain rooms. This game needs a patch. I'm just casually carrying around my mother's severed head. Nothing to see here. I know I'm supposed to carry it. I don't think this is actually happening. Something tells me this isn't happening. Oh, the fucking lag. It's just like, it's a stop. All right, let's, they sit by the river, right? Everything's on fire. Chuck it down the well. I think she's, this isn't actually happening. I think she's tripping. I mean, I still want to like, these are still here. Like, we still have to... We still gotta develop the photo. We still have that gothic line. There's something else. You know? This isn't happening. Oh my god. Like, everything is here. Holy shit. What has she done? Mother got the fucking sauce, bro. Oh my goodness. What's our next objective? Can we develop it now? Remember this moment over here? I don't know where I missed something. The power is back. Now I can develop the role and hopefully have my questions answered. Well, I have to print. Hold on, I gotta print. If that's if the if the print isn't there, my bike. The wheel is deflated as usual. A bicycle pump will solve this. Okay. Something's wrong. 
Guys, I'm I'm locked in. I can't move. Oh, come on. Two eighteen. That just happened. I'll load this. Alright. Well here's what I'm gonna do. I'm hopefully gonna try and print off that thing. I really hope I could still do that one mission, guys, where I, you know. Okay, right before I did it. Okay, I won't access the bike then. I'll see if I can print that. I thought I had to print it off. That's what it said. But maybe I had to go there, but. Because I really hope I didn't miss it. Because we seem to have developed, like, a very, very... Or, sorry, we seem to have gotten to, like, a very dark moment. And can you imagine just finishing up this one thing? The objective isn't there yet. Maybe it is there. We'll see. Yeah, this one. That's apparently in focus. Bro, that's gonna be the shittiest looking photo. Oh no, that's fine. The print should be fine like this. You can see detail clearly. Okay. Let's go finish up. I'm going to go, fi I, since I have to come back here, I'm just going to finish up the gothic line just so it doesn't glitch out on me. You know what I mean? Like, I just want to make sure. I don't want to print something off and find, you know, answers and all of a sudden I'm wrecked. You know what I mean? I mean, it could be vital to the war effort. I mean, like, they're about to lose anyway, right? Because by this point in the war, the Germans had basically lost, you know? I mean, it's 44. Well, I guess not quite. I think things were really cleared up in, uh, well, uh, 1945. Like, springtime of 45. That's when, like, the Germans surrendered, I believe. So I have to go across the bridge. I gotta say, this game has taken, like, not once have I really been scared. There was one moment where I was like, holy fuck, that shocked me. You know what I mean? Like, I was like, holy shit, like, that, like, came out of nowhere. But really, it's twisted. Let's let's just take a tally of what we've done in this game so far, ladies and gentlemen. And this has actually happened. Um, we cut off our sister's face. Um, According to Nanny, this was an old windmill. It has been we've abandoned for opened our sister's stomach post-mortem and took out a fetus with two faces. And we've apparently murdered and cut off our mother's limbs, including the head. There we go. The photo is where they've requested. Alright, well that mission's done then. Use the telegraph. Oh, so I have to go back. So I'm, we're not done using the telegraph. <laughs> I have been disgusted multiple times. Yes, that is true. I mean, how could I not be? I've never played a game like this ever. I've played a, quite a few psychological horror games. Usually they're involved with, um, like, you know, you're going through mental issues. Like, you know what I mean? Your head can't handle it. It's all, like, weird imagery and, you know, it, it's like a state of insanity and depression. This, I've never seen. I've never played this kind of a style where, you know, like, this is new to me, guys. This is totally just off the yin yang I can't see anything I gotta get down there I wonder if doing these side missions does anything for the story you know like actually does anything it's so damn dark I wonder if I should almost like brighten it up a bit I know it changes the mood but uh, where's the video 
I'll try 50. We'll see what that looks like. I think that's a little better. I can actually see what's going on. Probably know none of this is happening as she's been in the mental institution the entire time. You know what I mean? What am I supposed to say to them? I've left the... I have placed the photo where requested, so I need to find the right words to communicate it. Town oh, on course, fire. I need to remember the code word. Town on fire. <clears throat> um... Town on fire. Photo... What would it be considered? What would be the word? Town on fire. Photo. Positioned. I'm just trying to think of like a... Uh, is there a placed? Photo, positioned, place, no, positioned. Positioned. Town on fire, photo, positioned. Is it like... Photo positioned. Is it like an at? Building near river? Photo. Mm. Photo located, maybe? Photo located. Building. Is there a near? Yeah, building near river. Building near, where is it? Where's near? It's hard to see anything. Near river. That's where it was, right? Town on fire, photo located. Bu building near, re re near river. Over. Let's try that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so it's eight. No, no, this doesn't seem clear to no. me. No? I need to find the right words. So that's not right, okay. The photo of the map has been positioned. So she does tell you if it's wrong. Town on fire. Photo. Photo. Positioned. Um. Correct location? I don't know. Photo positioned. I don't know what to say. Like, it's so generic, but I think they'd understand what I'm saying. Photo positioned. Correct building. Photo positioned near building. No. Fo Town of Fighter photo, photo position building near river. Over. Try that. No, no, this Damn doesn't it. seem clear to me. Well, how the fuck am I, I supposed to, to tell the them? Right words. That is... They get what you're saying. That's what's annoying about that. I don't know what to fucking say. Town on fire. It's gotta be town on fire. 
Town on fire. Position photo. Um. Uh, correct building. No, no, this doesn't seem clear to oh. me. I need to find the right words. I wish you could look at the map right now, just so I could see. Does anybody have any suggestions what I should type to tell them that I put the photo in the right spot? Like, this is hard to read. It's so dark, you know? Position, photo. Oh, wait a minute. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. Position, map. It's a picture of a map. They're looking for a map. Right, maybe that's what's going on. Position map, building near river. Let's try that. Maybe it's because I said photo instead of map, because it's the map they were looking for. Over. No, no, this that's doesn't seem clear to me. I need to find the right words. I want to look at the map so I can look at what it says, but it won't let me without turning everything off. You know what I mean? Position map. Position map. Wait. Hold on. Town on fire. Map. Located. Building near river over. No, no, this doesn't Why is that not clear? Me. That is clear as right fuck. Words. I don't know what else to say. Map, po map positioned. Is there's no at, you know, there's no at. Map positions, there's no placed. Map positioned, bu building near river. That's what it is, right? I'll add over at the oh. end to make it clear that I have finished. Oh, wait. No, no, this doesn't seem good. This clear sucks. To me. I need to find the right words. This is really annoying, honestly. Oh, wait a minute. Is that what it's telling me? Is that the answer right there? Town on fire. Photo map positioned. Oh my god. Really? Photo map positioned. Over. Really? That's what that was clearer? What this is the same thing. Dude, I better get an achievement for doing this side mission. Over, that's a short one. Okay, let's see. Um, T, N, K, C. So C. E, A, C, A. R M C A R M Uh where is it? C A R M tank Okay um <clears throat> So E A so L C L C L C L tank L C L located And that's over, isn't it? Uh, T, K, yeah, over. They have worked out the position of the tank. 
I should confirm that I've understood their message with received. Received. Where is it? Received. Over. This is a big one. <laughs> Fuck bitches get money. <laughs> Over and out. <laughs> Okay, man. I don't need your life story. He's saying over, though. He's not saying over now. That's how you know it's saying over. Okay. Um. So, T. R. Y. T. R. Y. Or is it V? Oh, sorry. It's V, right? T. <laughs> R. <laughs> v, yeah. TRV. Find. A. R. M. Wait, right. Wait, hold on. Mm. Oh. A R O. Oh, wait, A R M. Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. Is it A R M or is it. Yeah, it's ARM. Weapons. Wait, I you, you don't want, I'm not even done. One second. Okay. A R M Weapons. Yeah, yeah. Julia's room was the one with the puppet show. That was in her room. Uh D P D P S T Cash two three S V C V C near B, woods. It could be woods or flag. One, two, three, S, W, S, B, S, it was a B, S, C. It's probably woods. Right? B, S, C, woods. Over. There's a weapons cache in the I woods. I already know where it is. We found that. In my woods. Okay. I will search for it. Let's respond received again. Received. Over. My God, why do you have to send me your life story? Oh my god, I thought we'd be done. I thought that'd be the last thing. Grab the rocket launcher and blow shit up. I want to see over and out. This fucking guy, man. Okay. That might be over and out. That might be over and out. AR. We'll see if it's over and out. A. No, you. Is there a U somewhere? No. So, oh, sorry. A. And then. A R. Yep. So over and out for him. All right. So this is his final message. Okay. So E. A W P. So P. T M. P Z. Is there a P Z somewhere? So place. Um. T. B. 
and BN. Weapons, probably. A flag, maybe? BND? BN. Hmm. One, two, yeah. Place flag. Uh. E. A. W. P. P. L. Place flag pole. Uh, L. L. C. L. S. L. S. C. L. C. Light. There's only two letters. Um. Mm -hmm. Oh, whoops. One, two, one, two. C. L. O. Close. C. M. M. Place flagpole, light, close communications, over and out. Okay, so... After I've been there, I will place a flag on the telephone pole near the house. They will then know that okay. I've accomplished the task. Easy peasy. So this is like a side mission in the mainer. Okay, so we know where the weapons cache is. I've never actually... I've been there like 6,000 times. But I've never actually... Like, I have been haven't been able to use it. You know what I mean? It's, yeah, it's right there. I don't want to go off the beaten track. I'll follow the track. I wish I had a flashlight. Because the flashlight was, we left it by mother's corpse. Because we're idiots. I mean, if you just do the single player, or sorry, if you just do the main story and you don't do any of the side stuff. But I like doing the side stuff. It gives you like a, it doesn't feel overwhelming, you know? And right now, I'm not even afraid of the lady in the lake. We've already talked to her. That's not that's not the threat anymore. I thought that was going to be like a ghost story kind of thing. But she's not. A, she, she gave us insight. You know, she kind of read our fortune. That was like one of those palm... She did a palm reading is what she did. The lady in the lake was a palm reader. Nothing more. Okay, well, I'm here, so now what? Wait, what? Hold on. Find a way to enter. Find the weapons cache. Estranged. There must be another entrance. So let's try and look above it, maybe. Hey, Bobby, it's going good. How are you? Fuckers. Unless, do you think that they're connected to this? It seems pretty far. Yeah, see, there's an actual door there, so there must be an ex access point. Somewhere... Like, if it, it, it must be, like, around this bridge. I'm going to go to the bridge area. Oh, wait, let's go this way. And, of course, it's dead of night, so it's, like, almost impossible to see anything. Guess I could crank the brightness until I find it.
maybe it has something to do with that farm area. Well, let's just go down here quick. Hey, profile's gone. It doesn't let me go in the river. Shit. No! Oh my god, I thought I was stuck for a second. Whose grave is this? Who the hell knows? I'm guessing that somewhere... Uh, I think if I go back to the barn area, there might be like a hidden entrance in there. I mean, the game doesn't like hide stuff like this. It's just, it's not its style. Wait, what is that? What's this? What a beautiful place. The tower achievement. What is that? What did I just find? Discovered the house in the woods? It's so fucking dark, man. I can't see. No, I don't want to get stuck on stuff. I think I accidentally stumbled upon this. Is this like a Blair Witch reference or something? God, this is kind of annoying. I mean, I thought maybe that was... I found a building. It's just a coincidence. Oh, my God. All right, fine. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. I'm trying to... Put it away, please. Go away. Put it down. Put it down. I'm not meaning to do that. I wish I had a flashlight. This thing is pitiful. Man, we've been looking to how to access this cache for far too long. But again, I'm going to head back to this farm area. Or not farm area, the... better get something sick out of it. I'm sure we'll get an achievement if they've been popping achievements up. I don't know where to go, man. I want to find it, but... It seems to be getting way too far away. Man, this sucks! Thanks for all the insight on this. Find find a way to enter. It must be somewhere in the woods near home. Find a way to, okay. A strange structure in the woods. There must be another ent entrance. That makes no sense. I mean, I don't think it's that clever enough for it to be like in the house. It, there wouldn't be an entrance point in the house. That's just no way. 
I mean, there's a map. It's showing me where to go, but that's the front entrance. That's the, it's blocked off. I have to find a side entrance. It's not telling me where to go. But then again, I haven't been over here, so I'm wondering if I try and go that way. When it lags, though, man, that's so annoying. It happens a lot. This game is not optimized very well. I'm gonna have to close my blinds just so I can actually see anything. I've been here already. I don't know. I, I think I don't think it'll be in the woods. It's got to be near like a oh fucking lag. Wait a minute. Wasn't there that one lantern with a knife on it or something? Well, that well we no wait the knife was used by the sister. I'm gonna try going around there. But it seems way too far to be a secret entrance to that. Or maybe it's up here. I don't know. Right, this is where the knife was and where the lantern was. It's not burning anymore. Use the boat? I was thinking, honestly, it might be this. Like, look, that would make sense, wouldn't it? Look, like, that looks like a... a I'm going to try getting in the boat and going to that. I tried going there before, but it wouldn't let me. It's possible... I really don't want to ride in the boat anymore because it's like the most annoying thing on the planet, but if it'll let me go. I'm sorry guys, this engine is so loud and obnoxious, so I'm just warning you ahead of time. I th if that's the case though... There it is. I knew it. I saw this on the map a long time ago, but it wouldn't actually let me go over this way. Culvert used to be covered in bushes. Someone must have worked in it recently. Because, yeah, I saw this little square dome thing on my map, honestly, and I tried going up here before, but it wouldn't let me. So, it, obviously, I had to wait for this ending part. Whoa, hello. Tunnel? Here? It wasn't there when I was younger, I'm sure of it. I don't know, Grant. I, I haven't had the time for any sports games. I'm hoping that I'll be able to get some free time in March to do some because the games There's are starting to lighten. There's been a whole world underneath us this whole time. I don't even know where I am right now. One might bring you to like another hidden area. I might double back. If this leads to the end, I might come back to the fork and go the other way. And look at all these directions. How do you know which way is which? Yeah, you'd think she'd wash it off, eh? Okay, well, that seems like a good place to go. I'm just going to go around the corner. It might all just lead to this location. 
When was this place built? I didn't know it even existed. Well, there's your grenades, there's your weapons. Fuck, the lag is so brutal in this game. It'll happen so random, like, you'll be perfectly fine. Did I go the right way? Mm, this place gives me the creeps. Car 98K. Mines. Not many. This isn't really a jump scary type of game. It's a psychological horror, so it's a little different. It's fucked up imagery is what it is. This must be a dormitory, but no one is here. Who knows why? Camera skin. This telephone doesn't work. Oh, it's probably because I cut that line. Right. So if I if it had let me go over here, do you think it would have actually I don't know. Dear Brunhilde, the heat here is killing me. We have been trapped inside the tunnel. It seems that command are preparing for something big, but they are not telling us what. The other day we went out on patrol and accidentally shot a young girl. I will carry the weight of this guilt for the rest of my life. I love you always. The hope of seeing you again is what keeps me going. T. The soldier who shot me, he thinks I'm dead. I don't feel any resentment. We are all hurting so much. Oh look, it's actually, I am on the map, so we're getting close to the exit. Because what we need to do is just open it from the inside, and then they go in and take all the weapons. Finally an exit. It looks like I'm back in the woods near the house. I need to find something to confirm that this is in the area. And the message they mentioned using a flag. I will pull the... I need to find something to confirm that this is in the area. And the... Huh? So wait, did I... Was I supposed to grab... Oh, shit. I didn't actually find it. Message Fuck you. Message they mentioned using a flag. I need to find something to confirm that this is in the area. And the message they mentioned using a flag. Does it matter what kind of flag it is? Can we use a... Okay, so I'm not fully done yet. I know how to get out of here, but... Like, this is completely extra shit, guys. This has nothing to do with the main story of what I'm doing right now. Fuck, it's so easy to get lost. Did they have a flag in here that I missed? Can I grab... Oh, that flag. Do I have to put up a Nazi flag out of all flags? Can we just, like, do, like, use underwear or something? I will hang this on top of the pole next to my house. That will confirm these tunnels are in the area. My mission will then be complete. Fucking better be, bro. Okay, my bad. I missed the flag. That's on me. I didn't notice it at first. I feel like there's multiple tunnels, but they all lead to the same area. You know what I mean? So, like, it's, there's, like, this section here. There's a section here, section here. But there's tunnels that just go that way. One goes that way, and they all meet up at the same point. That's my guess. But now we're done with this searching... We better get an Achievo. I think we will. I don't see why we wouldn't. And then, <laughs> don't forget, we still got Mother's head that's fucking chopped off, chopped off and just buried. You know, I don't know where. <laughs> just underneath the bridge. I'm not using the flashlight because it, it honestly takes up so much space and it makes the game lag for some reason. So, I, I think I, I see where we are. We're at the grave where we found homeboy. Hey, Shane. See, like, look at the chop, guys. This game is not optimized very well, unfortunately. It's very interesting, though, I have to say. It's like one of those games that's like... Sorry, let me see the map. Yeah, let's just... Let's go this way. Ah, see what I mean? It just, like, lagged and spun me around. I didn't touch my mouse there.
It's probably the one where I cut the line in the first place. This is where I cut the line. So it's either the one on the, t the thing. It's probably this one. Yeah, it's the same one. The same one where I cut the line originally. Hey, Grant. Do I have to radio it in? Whoa, hello. I have done everything they ask of me. That's the end of it. That's the end of it. I hope I made the right choice. The lover's achievement. So let me see. I knew we'd get an achievement for it. I mean, we get an achievement, that's the right choice in my book. Complete Lapo's quest. Makes sense that it's the lovers. There's still quite a few achievos left. Fix the bike. Completed the game's story. Played the second puppet theater. Oh, there's another one? Five photos with no story ink. Link? Oh. Completed all telephone calls for, for obtaining information. Taking a photo with every camera accessory. Taken all IR photos with hidden riddles. Oh, I haven't done that. Taken all four IR photos of the lady. And then develop ten photos in those story link. All right, well, here's what we're going to do then. We're going to try and get a ton of those. Okay, we're just going to... I know I don't have to, but... Here's what we do. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Um, it's going to be the lamest thing. Let's just... Well, no, we'll, we'll find some cool shit. Let's go, uh, okay, let's whip out the camera. I need to develop 10, right? Let me look at those achievements again. I need to develop 10 photos. Uh, fix the bike, that's something we'll have to do later. That's probably how we escape. Played the second puppet. I don't know how to do that. Five photos, with, so take five photos. So we'll take 10. Completed all telephone calls. I thought I did that. Taking a photo with every camera accessory. So every camera accessory. And then develop 10 photos with no story link. Okay. Use the camera. Every photo accessory. What do we have? The macro lens. Let's use an orange filter. That actually looks kind of sick. One. Take a picture of the archway. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> um, that looks like shit. Nobody asked. There you go, the Empress. We just got an achievement. It's right underneath me. Sorry, what was that for? That was like for no story reference or whatever. Take five photos and no story link. Okay. Develop ten. Taken. Okay, what was the other one? Taking a photo with every camera accessory. So I'll just keep snapping photos until I get them. Uh, what other we have? Take the regular. Nah, oh. This is rubbish photography. There it is, justice. <laughs> I just got it. <laughs> uh, every camera. So now I just got to develop all these photos. How many did I take? I don't really know. So I missed some hidden riddles. There's so, so this is probably placed around town. I'm going to end up getting most of the uh, achievements, though. Okay. So I think that should be enough. I'm going to go develop all, like, a bunch of non. It's going to take a minute. I'll still develop them because they can't stop me. I'm going to see if I can make any more phone calls. I, I mean, I think I did, but I might have missed out on some information because I might have made the wrong call. I mean, I know I got to fix the bike. 
Do I have to fix the bike to get away? Wait, let's try going back up. Maybe we can do the other sequence then. No. You know what? It's possible to do the devil sequence. You need to find all those hidden messages. That's probably what it is. Because I found one hidden message. It probably means to find another hidden message. Etc, etc. Alright, we're going to go develop a bunch of trash photos, guys. With no effort. Just so until I get the achievement. <laughs> Fortunately, it doesn't take that long. Horrible shot. I'll start with the ones that I haven't. I'll start with this one. Good enough. Yeah, it's psychological horror. What's up, Ariana? How you doing? That's actually kind of cool. I'm not going to lie. I've already done a couple of these, though. That's such a bad shot. Sure. I think we'll get it after about seven. After we do seven of these. So this is number two. So I've already developed a couple that weren't pertinent. It's not centered. I could have done better. I know this isn't very entertaining. We're li literally on like the brink of, um, on like finding out all this crazy shit. And we're just busy developing photos that don't really matter that much. <laughs> I wonder if you can develop the same photo twice and it'll still save it. I can't remember where we left off. This one, yeah. We gotta be close. That photo sucks ass. <laughs> oh my god, you can't even see anything. Maybe that's why it's so good. I love how our hands are still bloody. I'm gonna have to take more photos.
Okay, this is my last one that I took. I hope it's enough. At least you could skip it. I'm glad they had the foresight to do that. Wouldn't that be great if this was your last photo? You know what I mean? Like, it's like the last one, and once I do this, it's like, you unlock the achievement. Okay, I'm gonna have to look. Actually, I, there's a way I can find this out. Let me go to my album. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. I have ten. Why isn't it counting it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Dude, it's cheesing me. Let's take a photo of this. I think the Nazi helmet counted, didn't it? It's got like a story element. Yeah, what happened to the Nazi helmet? It's not there anymore. Unless I'm blind. What the fuck? Dude, there was... Yeah, the Nazi helmet is... Is gone. That's some cheddar. Maybe when I reloaded, it didn't count. Oh, I never developed it. Oh. I thought I did. I see what you're saying. Okay, we'll develop it then. It's possible it means, like, they're, the, their photos, they're not just random. Um... You know what it might mean? They're non-story ones, like, like the rent. I, oh, that's probably what it is, guys. It's not just random photos you take. It's like this. It's like these photos, the ones that you stop for, but they're not story based. See, I probably have to find more. So I've been wasting my time because I'm stupid. So yeah, I'm sorry. I can't get it because it's a collectible. I have to find more. I've only got a few non-story photos. I, I have two. I have the the helmet and um, I have uh, the knife. So I was supposed to take one of these. That's why. Sorry, I'm stupid. That's why. Okay, my bad. Sorry, guys. That was a waste of time. Let's develop what we need. That might be it right there, actually. Just don't fuck it up. Dear God, so it's true. I killed my sister. What? I did everything to hide the truth. Then I killed my mother to rid myself of the guilt. But she was nasty and everything was her fault. God, what does that make me? I don't deserve to live a second longer. Maybe I will see her again and I can try and ask for her forgiveness. 
But if there is nothing after death, at least I will be free from this suffering. I know it's not right, but I can't do this anymore. I fired instinctively at that soldier, hitting him right in the head, but it was not a good idea. He obviously didn't come alone. When the others came in, I closed my eyes. I heard a lot of commotion and then felt a sharp pain in the stomach. They were kicking me while another tried in vain to convince himself that the soldier on the ground was still alive. They hit me in the ribs, the back, and the stomach. I couldn't breathe and at the same time I felt the need to vomit. They were ordered to put me on a seat. They bound me up so tightly that I couldn't feel my hands or feet. On the seat next to me was my father. He was breathing, but he appeared to be unconscious. The guy in charge started asking me questions. He kept hitting me in the face and head with some kind of short cane. It looks like an American so flag, violent, though. I thought my skull would crack open. All I could taste in my mouth was blood and broken teeth. I ran my tongue across my teeth, thinking to myself that I'd never be able to smile again. A frivolous thought, perhaps, but a painful one nonetheless. Part of my top lip was cut open and was hanging down. I foolishly tried to put it back in place using my tongue and lower lip. I threw up. Yuck. They forced me to confess that my father had been carrying out all kinds of activity within the German army. Of course, I didn't know anything about it, so I tried to explain. But those punches... I would have done whatever it took to stop them. Whatever it took. Just after I told them what they wanted to hear, the general said, all it took were two slaps and you sold out your father, you German whore. Then he ordered my father to be executed. It took less than a moment. He didn't even move. He pointed to one of the soldiers and then he pointed to me. My time had come. They all left except for the soldier who had the unpleasant task of finishing me off. I wanted to die, but not like that terror engulfed me. I could almost hear the sound of my body evacuating. I had the gun pointed to my forehead. I couldn't look at his face. I stank. I felt indecent. Then he moved the gun on purpose and shot without hitting me. He had taken pity on me. It must have been my fate not to die. He quickly cut the ropes and pushed me to the ground, saying out loud, It's done. The German whore has been dealt with. I was left motionless on the ground. He left, and I fainted again. So what does that mean? When I came around, I did not know what to do. I was completely empty and felt pain everywhere. Everyone was dead. I was now alone in the world. I felt a desire to hear their voices one last time. Oh, this is in our basement. Recorder in the dark room. Provided the soldiers hadn't destroyed it, that is. I can't hit the map. Father, 
and we went to see what was going on. We found you sitting in your underwear at the side of the lake. You kept saying that nothing had happened, and you kept repeating things like that. I hugged you to try and make you feel better, but you did not speak again for days. What is happening to you? You should tell me what's going on. I'm not going to that loony bin. I would never have wanted this, but I'm afraid you will harm yourself further. You were really hurting yourself in front of the piano that night. What else could we do? You killed my sister and now you're afraid because I found out. So you're making up stories, aren't you? But I'm not falling for it this time. What are you saying? Your sister? Please, no. I was not well. I didn't know what I was saying. So many years have passed. You were little then. I thought everyone had forgotten that nonsense. Shut up. Don't speak. Don't say anything else. What are you doing, my daughter? Why do you want to ruin your life? I'm sorry. It wasn't me who just shot Mummy. It wasn't me. I didn't know who I was anymore. Everything had fallen apart. I was afraid of myself. My God, it was terrible. I had always been convinced that I was too good for myself, but then I had become my own enemy. I was the danger. What should I have done? I thought about the puppet theatre in my old room. There I could find something in myself, perhaps. So I rushed to go play with it again. One mass puppet show. What the fuck? What does that mean? I'll make a manual save. Hey, Jalen. What happens if I go this way? Is your hand still bloody? No. I wonder if I could still fix the bike. Or if that's my way of getting out of here. Like, is she pic Is she like seeing things? Like, I don't understand. Place has been ransacked. Well, sort of, anyway. Before I go play with stuff, let's leave. I'm gonna save, hold on. One more time. Is that a manual save? Yeah. Well, you can actually, it's like your way of fast traveling. I'm trying to wonder if maybe, like, her sister, yeah, is, like, herself. And she's, like, she's got multi-personality disorder or whatever. Like, schizophrenic and shit like that. Mummy nearly died giving birth to me. This is what remains in my memory of my mother's, nanny's, and father's stories. I remember little to nothing of my childhood at home. I have to try, though. Maybe the important events I should know are right there. It's like she's using this to kind of memorize things. Sorry, guys. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. One second. Damn it. Sorry about that. How are you, madam? I feel a sharp pain. Do you need anything? I can feel it. The time has come. 
Uh, I'm on ultra setting, Shadow. Everything is ready. Help! Something is wrong. Iri, help! Irene is not well. How are you, honey? I'm getting weaker and weaker. Doctor, hurry! Arena is sick! Don't worry, Irene. The pain you feel is natural. Push, Irene, push. I tried. Every time, every time I push right, it didn't work. Push, Irene, push. I see, you gotta alternate. The baby is born. I feel sick. I feel myself wasting away. It's going to be okay. Poor mummy. She has suffered so much. I have hurt her so much ever since I was born. <laughs> Mommy, I'm hungry. No, it's not meal time, you little nuisance. Mummy, I'm thirsty. You just had a drink, whiner. Mummy, I'm sleepy. Just keep painting. See, she, it's that same painting that was being done earlier. Like, every time we go to the paint room. There's just too much information we're not getting, you know? I just want to finish the, the painting. You can't sleep now. Mummy, I have to pee. That's enough. Go to your room. Get out 
of my sight. I can stand you no longer. <laughs> ah! The fuck? How dare you? I will make you pay for that. My hands are not enough. You need to learn properly this time. Sorry, it was an accident, Mummy. Please don't hit me. Oh my, okay. <laughs> Sorry, it was an accident, Mummy. Please don't hit me. I don't want to do this, but it's making me do this. Dumb. This is just a game. Is it only a game? I believe the white lady said that my lost memories would return in the place of my happy childhood. This is the only place I have ever been truly happy. Are these my memories then? Is this actually my life? I don't think she was ever deaf. What's happening? What's up? Did Julia make you cry? I have not done anything. Now I will make you cry. You rude girl. What is happening? My darling, Mummy loves you so much. Julia, play with your sister. Martha, don't you want to play with your sister? Seems something seems off. That doesn't seem right. I think I got it wrong. Can we play patty cake? I did mention we'd be doing patty cake, cake in this game. Did I not say something like that a little earlier? I love you, mummy. She's gonna say something really mean. What do you want? Can't you see I'm busy? A game Ooh. 
Now go play with your sister. What are you doing? Are you crazy? I'm angry with you. I will beat manners into you, you stupid little girl. Uh, like... Come with me now. Come with me. I will put you in your place, girl. Did she tie her down? Sorry, Mummy. I won't do it anymore. I promise. Too late. These false tears won't help you. Oh my god, dude. I am not going to do what they're going to make me do. There is no way they can do this shit. You are fucking kidding me. I am not. Now I'll make you want to bark. Dude, no. Don't you dare, woman. I'm... No, I... I you can't put the gun in my hand. There's no fucking way. No! You can't make me do that. You... Fuck. It's not real. It's not... Oh, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that, man. It's it's dolls, it's dolls, it's dolls. There's no point screaming, stupid girl. Oh. No, mummy, please. That's fucking terrible. Now I'll show you how insane I am. Help, Daddy, help! The worst thing is they're making me do this. Screaming won't work. Your father is not here like usual. Oh my god. Eat it. That can't be that can't be what happened. She's gotta be making this shit up. No fucking way. No. Eat. I won't eat him. Eat. 
I was beginning to remember, but I was so scared to remember too much, especially all at once. I didn't have time to guess exactly what happened. It was making me too upset. Pulling out those memories was like trying to pull out a tooth on your own. Almost impossible, and far too painful. The white lady told me that the church is a safe place and home to its children. Donatilio, my priest, I have to talk to him. I have to call him on the telephone. That was horrendous. I am mad that I had to do that. I don't care if it was like puppets, but to, to think that that actually had happened in her past. Like, we don't know. She could be crazy, right? Dude. It pushed the fucking boundaries. Holy shit. So we can only call Dawn one more time. speaking who is it father help me they're all dead daddy mummy everyone julia come to me immediately don't stay alone it's dangerous come to town you can stay here with me and we can talk about everything okay okay father but first i want to play with my puppets for a while julia don't be silly Come to church right away. Dude, she's insane. She is insane. My puppet theater is the only thing left. Go to San Castellano. Take the bike. She's insane, dude. There's something up. I, I could have fixed the bike earlier for an achievement, but I never did. It kind of glitched. Like, remember it froze? I had to find a pump. That's a good question. Oh, shit. I almost missed that one. Shit, let's go back. I thought I developed it. Sorry, guys. I'm going to go back and do that. fucking forgot about it man I forgot there was two I thought maybe there was two at the same time okay which one is it this one yeah this one I forgot to develop I will return to you, Martha. Together we will sort out everything. Just you and I. Okay, we just did that one. So yeah, I, I finished everything now. I just gotta take the bike now. Thanks for reminding me. I would have missed that. I don't know if it did anything, but I think it was just... I, I honestly guys I need to finish this game it's this is just honestly I want an answer is what I want 
Like, if this actually happened, that's the worst. I want her to wake up in a padded cell. That's what I want. That'll make all the sense, and that shit never really went down, but... Okay, I can't see. Where the hell am I? This way is where I need to go. Yeah, okay, I got it. Hop on the bike, and you start pedaling. We should be right on the verge of completing it, ladies and gentlemen, so... Fucking bonkers. I have to take a right this time. Thanks to the heroic assistance of Martha Kay, daughter of General Eric Kay, a mission devised by the partisans to steal weapons from the German army has been put to a stop. The same animals were involved in the killing of the general's other daughter, Julia Kay. And in an attempt to murder young Martha herself, the vile traitors were executed on the spot. Justice has been served for Italy, for Duce the second. So did I do the wrong, th did I help out the wrong people? Following chapter, oh my god. I don't even know if I should. They're actually asking me if I... W I mean, if they haven't asked me about the other shit. Man, we're already this fucking deep. Oh my god, what have I done? Those boys, they had all been killed and it was my fault. Oh Jesus, what they have I done? Age, and a few of them were our friends. I didn't think it would go like that. But wasn't it obvious, really? What was I actually expecting? I felt like a coward. But what could I have done? Should I have betrayed my father? I loved my father, but I also loved my friend Lapo. Which side was I on? I just listened to my heart. I thought it was the right thing to do. But instead, it was the worst thing I could have done. I didn't go anywhere near the soldiers. Germans or allies. They had all caused me harm. I didn't want to approach anyone for any reason. Once I crossed that threshold, I completely lost touch with reality. Everyone around me had died while I survived everything. I don't remember how things went. I just remember a big light and then photographs were being taken of me. There yeah, I always think of blood money when I hear this song. A doctor, I presume. He was asking me questions, but I didn't understand what he was actually asking me. He wrote something on a piece of paper and then two nurses led me away. I was in the mental asylum. Some women were talking to themselves. Others cried. Some were even covered in their own filth. Others were violent and tried to hurt themselves any way possible. There was this one young woman who would pleasure herself all day long, incessantly, to the point where she would bleed. 
so they would tie her down to the bed screaming, cursing and talking gibberish for days on end. Once her wounds had healed and she was untied, she would just start again. That woman was me. They started to give me injections. What they gave me made my whole body shake. I broke my vertebrae and an ankle. I think it was called cardiozole or something like that. My body was like a fire that didn't want to be put out. When it appeared to be quenched, it would come back, even stronger than before. In the end, though, they won. I stopped screaming and masturbating. I stopped thinking. There was no longer any need for therapy. Something inside of me had died. But nevertheless, I insisted on carrying along this painful journey. I was stronger than I could ever have imagined. I'm sorry, but like, did I click the censored version? I'm pretty sure I didn't. Like, it asked me, do you want the censored version? I said no. Unless it was very descriptive of what she was doing. I mean, that sounds horrible, but seeing it would be even worse. Don't go away. Talk to me about Martha, please. Martha is dead. I killed her to take possession of her life. No, she doesn't exist. I will never find peace for what I have done. I feared that would be the case. And what about Mummy? I don't know what happened. The thing is, I don't actually, I can't even answer these questions because I don't know what we saw, if that was even real. Do you know what I mean? I don't even know if it was even real. Mummy is dead. Nobody knows that better than I do, unfortunately. It's useless to try and deceive ourselves. Did I do what I think I've done? no other choice yes damn it it really happened i cut her into pieces and buried her under the bridge god all that blood my god i knew it what about daddy the soldiers did that really happen if i think back to that moment everything is muddled i do not know how to answer no answer is perhaps the most painful answer. What about Nanny? They said something would kill her. Nanny is fine. I don't even want to think that anything bad could have happened to her. Are you sure? That brings me great joy. I'm afraid to ask about Lapo. That man's dead. I mean, we saw him get shot. Lapo is dead. He was blown up by a landmine. 
He got into trouble and paid with his life. My dear friend. Poor boy. Just as I remembered, unfortunately. One last question. Okay, guys, don't talk about the spoilers pregnancy. if you know. Please shut up. If Martha doesn't exist. Man, fuck if I know. It doesn't make any sense Martha to me. Martha was pregnant. Her deformed baby died with her. Maybe she was in pain. That's enough now. All of these questions are pointless, aren't they? It's all inside of us. We just need to turn the mirror. Is it not all just the reflection of an unknowable existence? Nothing more than a puppet show. Could be. Ready for everything with open arms. Even ready to kill. Legs always ready to run. The womb that conceived in sin. Lastly, the mind. To protect us, it has turned us into monsters. Either way, we cannot live like this, can we? I'll take care of it. I don't need to worry. I'll try to sleep if I can. I've got this. On the 26th of July, San Casciano was bombed and the church was destroyed. But I was not there then. I was already in the asylum. Once again, stubbornly, I was not dead. The bombs hadn't killed me and I had also survived myself. The most absurd test and the hardest one. The war ended some time ago now both out there and inside of me. I was on the wrong side of the gate, but now I can turn the page. Life is opening its doors again, isn't it? If I hadn't been so lucky to survive myself, I would have thrown everything away. We think that danger is all around us, ready to attack. The most devious and misleading dangers are the ones that are inside of us. They grow without us realizing. They make us suffer, remain confused, and remove our self-respect. I would have wanted to ask for help, but I was alone. This is my story. Thank you for being here.
for listening to me. Now I'm ready to leave. How long will it take to get home? Dude, they better give us a better explanation than that, because that doesn't tell us shit. I think what they've done... <sighs> Man, come on. They've left it up to your interpretation, is what they've done. It's up to interpretation. So, unfortunately, I don't fully believe that any of that actually went down. But it didn't, like, it's like that little interview. I don't think it would have mattered what I said. You know, whether I said if it did happen, they were alive, they weren't, whatever. It didn't make any sense to me. I'm gonna just stick around for the cutscene, or sorry, for this credits to see if there's an after cutscene. Usually the games don't hide them behind it if you skip it anymore, but I don't even know what that meant. Like, it was all, I don't fucking know, man. It made no, I thought there'd be some sort of explanation. I mean, this still could be, this still could be. I don't think this is a this is an indie game, so I don't I don't think it would take that long. Or sorry, I don't think the cutscene will be that long. Or you know what I mean. Unless they're gonna literally go through all the voice actors for each language. I don't know if I should skip it. Can I speed it up? No. I mean, I can understand that being like an idea. It's like, how do you interpret it? Like, did it actually happen, did it not? But at the same time, I kind of wish they just explained it. You know what I mean? Oh, I can, oh, I can hold it, speed it up. Oh, so I can't actually skip it, okay. Wait, finale what? Finale four, did you see that? Ninety-three percent. So does that mean I got ninety-three percent of the game finished? The church. I mean, I thought it was gonna be way worse. The self harm I thought was gonna be way worse than that. I mean, it obviously is weird to watch, but. One second. Let me look at these here. What did I get? Complete the game story. The only achievements I didn't get were fix the bike. I missed that, obviously. I saw it, but I never actually engaged with it. Completed all telephone call calls for obtaining info. I must have missed one because I said the wrong thing. Taken all IR photos with hidden riddles. Taken all four IR photos of the lady. Developed four, ten photos with no story length. So that's like, it's all collectibles at that point. So, um... I don't understand, bro. I really don't know what that meant. Like, there really wasn't an explanation there, was there? It was very... I don't know. It, it's an, it's open for interpretation. I kind of want to do some digging into this and 
seeing what other people have come up with, you know, just see, hearing different theories because I don't, I don't fully get it. I think, um, I don't know. I don't think, I think Martha, so I'm going to just minimize this for a second. Um, I'm thinking based on that, I don't know if like she was actually beaten as a child or something else. Um, I don't think she really was. My guess is, um, or she was, she has childhood trauma, not even necessarily of her being beaten or something. And she kind of built up stuff in her head and she's gone like crazy. Right. And she never actually had a twin sister. Maybe that was just an alter that like, why do you think one wouldn't speak? Like, you know what I mean? It's like another side of her. Maybe I don't know. Um, I don't know. It's possible. She had like some of these, some of the things could be real. Some of them could be made up. You know what I mean? Like it's, it's definitely hard to differentiate which would be which. Um, and if, if that actually did go down, you know, like maybe for example, she did have a, um, she was pregnant and then maybe she wasn't, you know what I mean? Like, it's like, she was like searching within herself and like everything we did, like cutting open, like that could have been something that happened at, uh, at the, the asylum. She mentioned she was there. She went to the asylum, but was it, before or was it after like we don't really know so i don't know man i i this is one of the, I, I wish they did more explaining more explaining excuse me as to what happened with this but that is a it's truly messed up like honestly there was a lot of scenes and i can understand why it got censored on the playstation but at the same time it's truly an experience you'll probably never have you know like i've never experienced anything like that i've experienced some psychological horror where some messed up things happen but that was pretty up there. I think Outlast Whistleblower DLC had some pretty bad uh, moments as well. I don't know if you, you guys know what I'm talking about, I'm sure. And I extremely doubt that this um, this uh, VOD will save as safe for advertisers. <laughs> I extremely doubt it. But you never know. Crazier things have happened. Either way, I'd love to hear your guys' interpretation of this game in the comments. Let me know what you guys think. I'm Like I said, I'm going to do some digging into this myself and just kind of get some ideas of what other people come up with. I don't know if the endings are different um i don't know if it like it says i saw finale one two three four i ended up doing 93 percent of the game in the first run so i probably missed just like one phone call and maybe like a few collectibles here and there. that's all i could think of um so i'm thinking based on that based on the message of the game as well like what the devs put in i'm assuming yeah the childhood trauma did happen and it just caused like a spiral in her brain and whether what what you know, the details of what's real and what's not are become, were really blurred. So, um, I don't know, like I said, I don't know, depending on what choice I made at the end, if that had any difference, I don't know if it did, or me putting the flag up, you know, doing that side mission, if that had anything to do with it, I got an achievement for it. So obviously I'm going to do it, but, um, yeah, we'll have to find out. I'll do some digging and we'll see what happens either way, guys, if you enjoyed this stream, be sure to leave a like on it. Like I said, let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. Uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you are new, turn on post notifications with the bell icon so you don't miss anything that I put out. Don't forget to like, follow all my social medias as well. Got a Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and a Discord server. They're all linked in the description. If you want to get a shirt or a hoodie of mine, there's a link in the description. There's also an embedded thing right below the stream. You can scroll down and see some of the stuff I have available right here on this video. Uh, big shout out to all the sponsors of the stream to help keep it rolling. Uh, DX Racer, Bones Coffee, Always Bearded, The Ridge Wallet, Mad Rabbit Tattoo, and Jinx Custom Controllers. I use their products every day, and you can check them out for yourself with the links in the description. Make sure you're using my promo code DanQ8000 at checkout. And finally, guys, be sure to check out and sign up for the Team 8000 membership program if you haven't done so already. It does support the page a lot. There's three tiers available depending on your budget, entry, basic, and a premium. You'll get perks for signing up, obviously, such as badges by your name, custom emojis to use in chat, exclusive videos and streams, priority and open lobby access. If you go the premium route, which is the top tier, you'll get your own 20% off discount code to use my merch store. That's exclusive to you, as well as entry in the monthly game giveaway where at the start of each month, I do a draw where I throw all the premium members, throw them in it, pull a name, that person will win a game of their choice. Um, literally, they tell me what game they want, I buy it and send it their way. It's as simple as that. You can check it out, guys, with the link in the description. Join button below the video and on my main channel page as well. Guys, tomorrow, we're probably going to be starting up a brand new game again uh, with the next Grid game, Grid Legends. So I'm going to look into that. And like I said, we, we finished a few games, so we're going to be bouncing between the few in the next few weeks. Um, but uh, I know people are asking about Elden Ring. I probably won't pick it up just due to the style. It's not my jam. But I don't know. Things could change. I'll let you know. March is going to break up. I got to worry about finishing a ton of these games that happened, that released in February. March, there's way less of them. So I'll try and do that. Go back to NBA, NHL, what have you. So don't worry. We will be back into it. Just bear with me. We'll be back in, uh, you know, Horizon as well. So 